All right, what is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome to EVAC uh, at University of Adelaide. It's the 10th of September, 2024. My name's Kaiser, and I'm live here with a Super Smash Bros. Melee tournament. Um, we're going to be getting it started very soon. We'll have the bracket up in a moment. We've got some stream matches coming up in a second, and hopefully we're all going to have a good time. Hopefully. Some of us will have a better time than others. We will see. We will definitely see. Um, okay, so let's get this show on the motherfucking road. Um, Alright. Uh, I'll get the packet in chat and then we'll get started. Just need to adjust the cameras and whatnot. Yeah, great, cool. Nice. Um, so we have another up and coming Falcon against Kyle, crusher of SA up and coming Falcons. Gotcha, gamers. I'm back. Are we in there? Oh, we're still in there. All right. Yep, yep. All right, cool. Let me push this down a bit. Um, we might just turn that down a teeny tad. Let's go, SA. Let's go. You know, I, I agree with half of that. I'm not sure I agree with the let's go swag. No, let's go swag. <laughs> no, I know. I'm, I'm late in Kyle. Favoritism for me. Well, I would know. hope so. You'd hope so, yeah. I would fucking hope so. Yep. Gonna just... Yep. There we go. Down there. That's okay, great. Better. Um, oh wait, what's this actual Falcon punish? Oh. No way! No way! No. <laughs> no way. Nah, Caleb's gone better. This Falcon punish. It's um. He actually has. It's just funny to make fun of it. It really is. Ugh. It took so long. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> are your ears alright? Yeah, my ears are good. Okay, if you need to adjust yours, this one. That one? Yeah. Yeah, that's cool. your ears. Okay. Um, I should go post this. In the meantime, do you want to just look up there? Yeah, sure. Uh, while I adjust some things. My second screen. This is actually very close. They started bod, which is I sort of can see. Just Falcon getting quick kills off the sides. No. Oh wait. Okay. We're gonna close this out. No. That's you know we just start try to random there here and there and um. <laughs> It's just that movie, it's like a fucking truck. Oh, that's such a 
I I think that down smash is terrible. I think it's such greedy gameplay to do it raw in neutral. Just you're really just kind of hoping that they fuck up their like if Falcon fucks up his dash dance spacing and does it right next to you. Oh wait, this is down. Okay, we so we got the tag from the Falcon, but then no immediate up B. And if that's a consistent thing, then that pretty much gives Carl just the opportunity to pretty much try any aerial when Falcon's recovering from below. Because honestly, like if they just tech, then they just drop back down again. They use rinse and repeat. Oh, side B actually working. That's wild. And is this it? Nice. Really good, actually. It's that little up air just to get that bit extra before in there. All right, first one to Kyle. Yeah. Nice job. Okay, hey chat, how's the audio? Do I need to turn the game or the commentators up or down? Let me know. I think it sounds all right. Uh, we probably need to check when's best of five, best of three. Yeah, we have eight people tonight. Audio is good. Thank you, Bab. Appreciate it. I'm going to assume it's top five or top four. Best yeah. of. Oh, we have me and Riz. That's cool. You are 2 -0. Awesome. Okay, let's... Everything's good, thank you. Sorry. Okie dokie. Uh, well, my controller's over there right now. Yeah, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Maybe give me a sec. Yeah, well, um, when yellow's available, we'll send Musket on his merry way. Um, I need water anyway, so give me a sec. Anyway, going to Yoshi's, this is definitely, um... Swag loves this stage just because the classic, the, um... Yeah, top platform knee. And honestly, he's pretty good at it. He is. There's not much he's good at, but that, that, that's what? something. What? What? Yeah, you're not wrong. You're not <laughs> wrong. <laughs> Wait, did I, I, I say something? I was, I, was trying to be, I was trying to be good cop, but then I realized I hate being good cop, so... <laughs> you know. He doesn't do anything. It's the, the fact that he does something good is an insane compliment to someone at this level. Probably, most, one, no, most people at that level don't do anything good. That's... <laughs> 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 Kind of two people on stream being bad cops. <laughs> oh, you can, you can. But I'm not even trying to be a bad cop. It's just, yeah, just want to be. <laughs> so if I say someone, if you, if I say something you're doing is good, and you're at like swag's level, it's a legitimate compliment. That's true. That's true. Yeah. This game's hard. It is annoying. That's right. Ooh, wait, nice. we're going to down Are we going to check? No. Oh, right. Good, good take away by swag. Oh, oh, I love that oh my god. Alright, we're trying Ooh. to go to top platform, but Carl knows that's the danger zone. Exactly. Not letting, not letting <laughs> oh shit, is that. No, not quite, not quite. Not, not that very good. Oh, insane baits going that's on right. here. That kind oh, of, that's. I love that. That's beautiful. That's what this game's about, actually. Alright, here's the best Falcon in, in Australia by some metrics. What's the AOK stand for? Just feeling good. He's AOK. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's. that's <laughs> <laughs> what my first call was. I'm see if that was some drug related thing that I thought <laughs> about. But like, I'm gonna assume. I'm gonna, I'm gonna assume it's just A-OK. -okay. He's yep. just chilling. And that's what we're about at SA Locals. Mm -hmm. Good vibes. Good vibes and positivity. Um, loving gaming. And watching Icy's, uh, watching Icy's lose to Peach. <laughs> yeah, that's what sometimes we're... Peach, sometimes Puff lose to Peach. When the Icy's doesn't work out. <laughs> oh, that's sad. <laughs> Why'd we go for it again? <laughs> we're trying our best. Ooh, good air. Hi, Clem. How are we tonight? Decided to watch some side. Ooh, that was kind of a good space knee. That was like a little bit too early. Okay. That was a good up air, too. Let's go swag. That's so high, gosh. I had my uh, my frame one. <laughs> uh, I was playing Muscat and Friendlies, and then it flashed itself. Yeah. Not in the fun way. In the my but my layout went back to base layout, and I do not play on base layout. It, in the middle of playing, so that we had a we had to do some surgery, some software surgery, but it's back. <laughs> 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 no, I can't comment on that. Oh well, good night. He tried. Swag. And that's what matters. Uh, can Maybe. we have a KP Kaiser and a Rosara Flame on stream? Thank you. Love you. All right, let's like update the layouts or something. Do you reckon Kai's gonna be left or right? 
You know what? Looking left. like looking like left. That was no. that was late. That, no. was, that was after no. Riz already sat down right. So you know. Congratulations. You did it. Why are you looking at me like that for? I'm I'm being friendly and congratulating my players for their meaningful victories at South Australian Evac tournament. What? Can I have a hug? You have me, idiot. Oh, the classic. Yeah. One of many classics oh, okay. <laughs> here to be tonight. We have uh, a name this tournament, uh, the almost return of JJ. We didn't quite get him. Not quite. Maybe next quite. time. Almost. One hour. One, oh, oh, it, was, it was one hour away from having JJ. Came in. Came in. It was like, wait a sec. There's no one here. Check the time. It's late. This is the tournament says 6.30 and no one's here at 4. This sucks. <laughs> I'm leaving. Maybe next time. <laughs> Maybe next time. Uh, what a beautiful game we played. So Kai versus Riz. Kai, um... Kai Tid, uh... Practicing the Tid standing stance right now. Kai... Finding their smile. A, yeah. I feel like there's, there's a short... There's a little Shawn Michaels moment. <laughs> where it's like... They lost their smile. And now they're just looking to try and find it again. And this, um... Maybe, maybe you find maybe. a best Rosara flame. I don't know a single human being I can imagine on the planet that would find their smile back best Rosara flame. Right. <laughs> but... <laughs> <laughs> maybe Kai can pull out something that uh, I consider impossible. You know, I'd find my smile. Mostly because I'd be talking <laughs> about POE. Yeah, but it wouldn't I, be a melee smile. It wouldn't be about melee smile. It'd be, it'd be, be like, oh, I like hanging out with this person. Not a, not a, I like playing. Because as soon as you stop talking, you have to look at the screen and what's happening <laughs> yeah. on the screen. And then you're like, oh god, oh shit, what the fuck are they doing? <laughs> <laughs> I don't think Kai versus myself have ever resulted in either play finding their smile to <laughs> Yeah, I, I don't think so either. <laughs> I No, I um, uh, I love I love all the odds Falcos. I um, just hate they're all such sweeties. I uh, they play Falco. What's that about? I didn't time it. <laughs> I, was, I was still like no in my time. classic saying um, oh yeah, no, I just enjoyed the Falco practice because it's like a matchup that I'm like not confident. That I don't think I'm good. And I was sitting there like this is a dinner um right after Floating Point on Sunday. Had an entire table with, like Lax, Jordy, <laughs> and they're all like, "No, no, you're good at that match, y'all." <laughs> I'm like, oh, yeah. "Is the table of people who have lost the Moscow?" Yeah. Um, yeah, you're definitely not. I think they're just not very good. Um, I'm getting better. I'm getting better from just like by virtue of playing. But every every sixth Michael set is a valuable experience. Oh yeah, Monkey was on the table as well. Yeah. So just had, like, <laughs> oh, literally, free. you yeah, literally oh. got the fucking the oh, uh, ever just missing Kai. Mm -hmm. Well, Hyrie's back though, oh, and yeah, actually yeah. grinding, yeah. which is uh, and really? entering every tournament. That, that's cool. Oh, yeah. Let's see how that goes. I almost lost to that guy. Oh, yeah, I remember that. <laughs> yeah, I was. Thank God he double lasered. Mm. Uh, that's all I'm gonna say. That is that is legitimately been my experience. So many like, especially big Falcos. Yeah. But it's just, like, I remember way back playing Reef. Um, in friendlies, and a lot of times I was like, wow, this guy's actually doing a lot of stuff, but then he just double lasers and dies like two times every stock to running double shine. I actually thought about this, and I'm like, is Kai just Rosara flame with Falco? Ooh. I'm kind of. I was, like, I was like watching those two like play just then, and I'm just like, oh my that God. was fucking sick. Let's go Riz. Maybe I could get my smile back watching Riz. <laughs> I don't think Falco, I don't think Falco would though. I don't think, um, Ooh, what a shine out of shield. Frame zero. It doesn't get the way that. I don't think Riz is looking to get um, her smile back. I think she already found it for POE. Uh, and maybe Lee. Yeah, that one must have That one. <laughs> yeah, that one. <laughs> Why? Oh. oh, I do. I do. I do love. I love the way Riz talks out League. It's kind of beautiful. Yeah. It's the. It's the business. The, the statistics, math school way of talking about League of Legends. Okay, how are we getting off? Really? All right. So we don't have. Yeah, no, no. Riz doesn't have. Like, if you've noticed, there's no. We have no tech skill. I don't think we've uncle punched this game in yep. like five weeks. Mm -hmm. But with Fox, sometimes that's okay. So, what, are you trying, what are you trying to say, huh? Nothing. <laughs> you mean, all of, you just exactly. have to, hardest character in the game. What there's mean? a lot of very easy buttons you can press. And we can definitely dumb the gameplay down a lot. You can't lose that much. Ooh, I'm, I'm not sure about that. <laughs> oh, I don't know. I don't. I, I, I hold my opinion. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
<laughs> no. <laughs> Not that much. No. A little bit, a little bit less than that. The yeah, Caleb would agree. Hate Caleb. I love Caleb. <laughs> Where the fuck is he? I miss him. Okay, oh. nice. All right, it's humming. It kills. Oh, oh no! Yeah. Oh, I, I, I just thought everything went wrong at that point. Do you see a fox on the battlefield that clearly like oh, it's... isn't comfortable moving? Yep. Whoa. Oh, it's... okay, nice. Dude. No, that's so fine. Oh, the light shield poke. I love that laser. My laser is a cool laser. I'm gonna look back and every game or whatever looks to yellow. Still playing. The fuck are those up is? That KP guys are special. Mm -hmm. I love that. The Ky Paco's up here. Sometimes it works and you're like, wow, it's the move. Sometimes it's it doesn't and it hits for like free and they get out and you're like, wow. It's, it's, yeah. That's Fox as well. You know? Oh. We need. Single hit. Single hit. Nah. Spacey up there. That's what I'm saying. Like I like the fact that it doesn't do anything after that. <laughs> Big fan of that. Because if it, if it did do something all yeah, the time. I'll be honest. It'd be kind oh of Oh my fucking god. Just, oh. All right. Just classic. That's what I mean. I was just like watching these two. And I'm Kai's just like... The way, the way they think, really close, and like the way like the outplay, it's like oh double shot. Oh, <laughs> you, I mean, every, I, every I you love, get a shine. I love the, the little peak in your voice when that happens. Yep. No, and there's like a little. Oh, okay. Well, we decided to kill ourselves. That is uh, that was not my logic, Caleb. Okay, but that's okay. I understand why you may think that. No yeah, that, that Falco dash tag, not disjointed. Does not cover, does not cover ledge there. Oh. But no, whenever you get a um, knockdown and you see the Falco tech towards, um, well, towards the edge of the stage, there's a little dopamine here where you're like... <gasps> but no, Kai's actually really good at yeah. um, teching the uh, double shine. Very, so very often it just results in a shine and then uh, back outwards. I just looked over to see Sag hunt. On his phone. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> real life stuff, basically. <laughs> yeah, unlike everyone else in this room, it does not have to deal with real life stuff. Nope. Never had to deal with real life stuff. No, no, no it's going great. <laughs> we exist in a vacuum. We do, like everyone, <laughs> except except for you, the protagonist. Mm -hmm. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> you, ex everyone except the, the protagonist, Swagman. <laughs> Okay. Riz actually not like some foxes that play like Riz like struggle to slow it down. I feel like Riz oh. is doing like quite a good job of not having tech skill. Mm. Yeah, because a lot of times they'll still try and play the same the exact same way. Yeah, and, and it, it just doesn't work. Yeah. Or Riz is just like, all right, I'm just gonna like wait in these spots and I'm just gonna do like the easy back air and wait and shine. Oh, that was a really nice up tilt. Yeah. Riz is quite good at waiting and just mm. like, 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 doesn't feel the need to do stuff immediately. Mm. Just like wait for a opponent to do something. It's a lot. It's missing skill in a lot of places in this country. It's hard. It's very tempting to just play like a bracket. Yeah, it is. Be like neutral time is over. You can just yeah. like wait a little bit longer. That's all right. You don't have to press one straight away. It's chill. But neutral phase is over. It's punish phase. Oh, I same back for dash stack. Oh, okay. Yeah. Nice, I think. Alright, we get a jump. Alright, that was a good bear. Well, I'd hope you'd be saying that, because yeah, otherwise, exactly. why the fuck you were playing that character? <laughs> it's not because he's good. I mean, what? Playing for the bread. What bread? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh, yeah. Six on the SAPR that will never release. <laughs> <laughs> I think Caleb actually genuinely. <laughs> That's a, honestly Caleb's that. reaction to that is a good part of the reason I haven't done anything about it. Yep. It is quite funny. Oh, I don't yeah. care. Person who has like talked about it five times in the last two weeks. <laughs> I was like, honestly, I don't think about it until Caleb brings it up. Well, Caleb in the horror is blah. I'm like, oh yeah. Yep. That's what not caring, caring actually is. It, absolutely. <laughs> uh, All right. Can I have a Kyle? Yeah, you got me, and then you got a hunter yellow at some point. Yeah, I'm just gonna stand outside. Like, I'm gonna hover around Love his you. set and play.
What's up, chat? How we going? <laughs> Yo, shout out to Yosh. Hello, Caleb Video Games and gay people are real. <laughs> uh, How come I can barely hear you? I'm not sure. Maybe it just need to be turned up a bit. I don't know. You seem should be like all the way up already. I don't know. It's weird. Uh, I don't know. Hang on. Let me do this. Uh, uh, there we go. Try that. All right. I'm talking now. I That's mean, better. Uh, I'll just crank you up a bit. We'll see how right. that goes. We've got. We've got Kyle rocking truck. Or is it the other? I can never tell these two apart from gameplay. I just see the stock count, and that's all I can tell. I can easily tell them apart in gameplay. <laughs> Ready? All right. Um. Okay. Uh, Tor is definitely Carl, though. 100%. All right. We. Let's update those names. Um. <laughs> so what's crazy, Yosh? I just wanted to give you a shout out real quick. Is that literally last night someone said realize, realize to me, like over the bar? I'm just like, yeah, for sure, you're right. AI is a problem. And yes, there should be regulations. And he's like, check this out. And he had like the Viva Vendetta, like uh, Guy Fawkes mask, and it said realize, realize. I'm like, that's so epic, man. And you're so right. I'm, I'm on board 100% with you. I can't tell if you're like joking around or not or if it's like... This is a real thing that happened and I was like I had no choice but to be like I agree with you man because like I work at a bar and stuff so it's just like well I'm just sort of locked <laughs> you know I'm just locked in there and there's not much I can do about it Personally, I think we need to remove all legislation referring to any AI or any technology in general I think we just need Complete anarchy. And talking of complete anarchy, uh, McLeod currently up a stock, tearing complete anarchy. Uh, they're both pulling turnips and doing aerials. I don't know. They're doing uh, how, how do you tell these two apart? Because I just okay. see the two main thing. Floating around. The main thing for me is a. Uh, it, it's is just faster. that if you breathe on McLeod, yeah, if you breathe on McLeod. She'll just like pop out like three moves instantly. Yeah, McLeod is a lot faster in my opinion as well. All right. Those are the main like tells. Kyle is the only human being to play Taisy. That's not true. Caleb, do you remember Shaky? The legend? The guy who was uh. So he 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 was prophetic actually. He said um. If you're playing Peach, it's really important to hold on to the turnip because uh, if someone starts combing you, she can drop the turnip and then, um, you know, break out of the combo. I'm like, that's so wise, Shaky. Also, you know nothing about this game, but all right. <laughs> all right, man. Go, go, go your hardest. Yeah. There's a great VOD where um, I throw my controller at the end of a set I lost to Nick once upon a time. It's the only time I've ever spiked. And um, it was because... And, like, halfway through the last, like one or two stocks, I yell at Shaky behind me, who is going on about like, yeah, so I think I'm going to play on stream next. Uh, and he was planning on playing Ice Climbers and just wobbling or playing Kirby like on stream. I think I think against Kyle, actually, now that I think about it. And I'm like, oh my god, dude, shut the fuck up. I was so pissed off that he dared to have that level of entitlement and losing to Nick at the same time that I'm just like, fuck this. <laughs> I don't know. Like, Into the earth, my controller went. Was it? Because all I hear from the story is that somebody's planning on like playing the game. I'm guessing it was more of a thing like, oh, they're gonna like. Oh, wait, no, Shaky was a. Like, no, Shaky was a notorious troll and would intentionally try and time people out because he thought it was funny. Uh, and I'm oh, just like. You know that like we only have like two or three hours at evac, right? Yeah, I respect it as a legitimate strategy, and, and you know, I feel at a major I do, not at a local. Well, I don't think it makes a difference, you know. I think, I think uh, if you're playing to win and playing to improve, you should do whatever it takes, and I don't think that you should let social constraints change the way that you play. And I'm inclined to agree, but I also hated this guy. Fair enough. <laughs> The thing that really, like, I don't know, I've taken an extended break off of Melee and I've come back and I feel like I'm refreshed and I feel like all That's of so the good. programming that I had before 
I'm not I'm like, it's just like, not necessarily that it isn't there. Because I, it's there, but I'm now more aware of it. That's good. And it's one of those things where it's like, I don't know, thinking back to my conversations about the game, I need to be more mean to people. I need to be more yeah. aggressive. I need to just force At least my game, will right? a bit more. No, in, I mean in social situations. Uh, Close game one. And, um, yeah, but I mean in game as well. But just the way that you view the game, I think comes through in your gameplay more than you would believe. And, like, you got to... Everyone says, oh, you got to believe in yourself. Yeah, but you also got to believe in your character and all that. And all that. And what it really comes down to, I think, is just your view of the game forms the way that you actually move your character. And if you view the game as, oh, we have to run each at each other, oh, we can't go to time, I think that that just limits you. And I think that there's so much more melee to be played, you know? Uh, on that note, you know what's crazy about what you're saying is I wore my red shoes today so my Falcon would run faster. Because I genuinely believe the color red is a little bit quicker. Yeah, yeah, and it does. And it does. And if you and my go Falcon's out, going insanely fast today. He's I, like, he almost fell off the screen. I took one percent just running forward because the camera couldn't keep up with me. Dude. I guarantee you, if we all went in a running race right now, you know who would come second? Yeah. You. And who would come first? You? Kai. Oh, okay. Because yeah. Kai oh, has more red shoes. That is more. Yeah, you're right. I didn't even realize that. You know, I raced all of my coworkers uh, at, a, at the work party when we were drunk a couple months ago, and I clobbered my entire workplace really badly. <laughs> <laughs> Which is really funny because I'm like it. Not it completely <laughs> makes sense as well. I have seen the people at your work, <laughs> not the most fit bunch, no, but it also no. speaks to the fact that you were it's probably taking stuff. it far more oh, serious. Yeah. They were all having fun. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I was winning. It's <laughs> uh, a good time. Uh, I, uh, I don't know what to make of these uh, tags. I don't know what they mean. Yeah, and, and they've been running them for like a year plus. I so know a yawn is what Kai's. That's partner. Kai's partner. And then uh, Game tag, yeah. Tort is uh, Yordle the Tortle. Yordle the Tortle is my actually old from uh, no, Torterra, the Pokemon. Oh, know? I thought it was Tortuga, which is uh, Spanish for tortoise. It's Tortuga is also the name of another Pokemon as Wait, well. Really? That yeah. Is crazy. So who knows? It could uh, be uh, in many different Pokemon, or it could be something completely different. I was only being uh, and uh, McLeod is Trot. McLeod is yeah, Trot. I, I don't know. Wasn't that like a I gang it, of like? I thought Trot was like a brony thing, like an every brony. Thing. Yeah, but I heard that it was also like a gang of people in Oz Smash that like played Hecarim <laughs> and Lilia. Yeah, yeah. That, I did tell Jeffy that. I said when the Kai's <laughs> thing, when the Kai's thing lane, and everyone's yawning to you be like, you maybe Yo. got a bit MTV pranked there. That Jeffy. was an MTV. Yeah, that was uh, you got you got scared. You got Scotty, Scotty and the kids. <laughs> the, the ninjas. I think. The Scotty and the Ninjas. <laughs> what a great show. And Frank, Frank Trichol. Yeah. An Australian classic. Up there with Del Toro Quest. Del Toro Quest? We were talking Emily, about this Emily, recently uh, at a Costco. That's 2 0. Wait, is that GG's? I think. Is that? Yeah, I think that oh, is. Oh, it's, it's, no, it's best of five best now. Of five. Do you know why it's best of five? Because uh, uh, this matchup notoriously is very quick. So mm -hmm. other matchups like Falcon Peach, we have to do best of three. Because um, God forbid I get a guy there and pick a stage I want to go to. Yeah. And wouldn't Kyle know at this point that it's best of... Or does Kyle think that McLeod just didn't ban a stage out of disrespect? What? I have no idea. Who won? <laughs> yeah, did you win? Yeah. Yellow's asking... Uh, Yellow... Muscat Yellow. Who won? How much? Two? Two, three, two? Three, oh? Oh, wait, no, it's two, oh. Okay, I forgot that, yeah. Yeah. Because this one is uh, best of five. Uh, Yellow, you have to play Rosaro Flame. Yeah, sure. This is this is last game. You could play on stream. Oh, never mind. No, no, Kai Kai Buscat's on stream. All right, I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna say I won a game to make me feel better on the bracket. Nah, I shouldn't do that. Cause then like we're gonna forget that I did that as a joke, and we're gonna think I took a game, and it's kind of like muddy history. I accidentally gave myself negative one games. You know what? Fuck it. 
That can stay. Is Bracket in the chat, by the way? Does anyone want You have okay. Fucking numlock is turned up. Oh, dude, I'm I. <laughs> Yo, Kaiser's chat is so quick. The the bot was not only did it respond to a misspelling of bracket, it did it earlier. That's crazy. I have moonlight. I don't really know who. Oh, I do know who moonlight is, but I don't know where they are. And she might be playing ultimate. And she might be winning an ultimate. You don't want to play someone who's just won a match. See, my idea is that if Moonlight wins whatever ultimate match she's playing right now, she's going to be in a good mood, and that might give her like the momentum to knock me out of spread. So I've got to wait for her to lose an ultimate match before approaching. Oh, uh, I see. I see the issue with that. Because she has momentum for winning. Yeah, I mean, I... Some people feel unstoppable, and as Mizarro Flame was saying, once you have the mindset, you can carry into your gameplay. Alright, can you hear me alright, by the way? Yeah, I can hear you. Alright, that's good. Um, so I missed what happened in the last game, but we're like down to like two stocks each, so let's just focus on the present. I think Kyle has good odds to at least get a game, because it's FOD. What do you think? Wait, I'm, I was going to wait for that stock to get taken, and I was going to say, yeah, Kyle's got this, but now that the stock did not move, <laughs> I think Kyle's going to get You're there. losing confidence, and yeah. there it goes. Yeah. There it goes. <laughs> Sorry, that Nair should have killed me. I guess the FOD sucks. I think this A little, is yeah. Like, this stage is silly. Okay, first of all, Jeff T, don't listen to Swagman's <laughs> propaganda. That's not the truth. I use the yawn tag because my partner's online tag is yawns. <laughs> I used to do like Y W N S, and then and then people were like Whoa. yawns. Whoa! Oh, hold, on, hold, on, hold, on. hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. He's so good. That's it. <laughs> you were right. It was GGs, shake my hand. Good stuff. Yeah, this might be the th the reverse three O. <laughs> Roy, what do you mean you don't know how Jeb T fell for that? Don't forget it, Phantom. 2022, you thought I was Ethan. You thought I was Kiwi. <laughs> That's, even like That's even funnier. That's even funnier. Holy way worse. shit. <laughs> oh shit. Dude, that was, okay, McLeod is switched on now, <laughs> yeah. And this is like uh this is the stage that's gonna like separate the grinders from the, the not grinders, I feel like. Do you think this stage is going to show that Kyle is busy playing gacha games whilst McLeod's, uh... I don't know, what do you, how do you grind melee? Do you, do you play single player or do you go melee grinders? Like, what's actually better for you? Um... I don't know how to put it, but I think... Honestly, you can get a such a... You can get such a big, like, advantage over other people if you just do a lot of solo prac. Do you know what I mean? I think like playing other people a lot only helps once you've done that a l also a lot, right? What do you do? But like, what do you do in solo practice? Like, I launch game Uncle practice. Punch because I you, you, you want to do punish game practice. You want to set up situations where like, all right, like if I get hit, I can get like 50% out of shield, right? What, what if what every if time, every time? And you know what I far? did? You know what I did? I did like uh, back when 20xx like 3.0 was out, yeah. um, I would go to FD, put infinite shields on, wait for the bot to hit my shield, and then I'll be like, shine out a shield, try and get the kill off that, right? And I would do that 50 times, and if it didn't kill off that one interaction, I would hit the like save state reset button until okay. I got 50 of them. So you did that? Yeah. But did that make you better at this game? Yes. Easily. But, but is it the is it, is it as important as you, you... You brought it up as the first thing you can't... I think is it's it one of the first though? things you should do. To get to get a big advantage over other people is to do that. So do you believe that listening to people who've done it before is a good thing? Because like, what if, you're just, what, what if before? you're just naturally goaded at video games? And listening like, to people who... And who then I do everything before? that you Sorry? did, that I've done it before, that I've got good. Oh, uh, I see, I see. So if I start doing the things that everyone's like, yeah, I did this, it's like, yeah, but if this person just played the game, they also would have got good. Okay. You know, like, how do um, we differentiate? How, do, how can I measure success from my training? Okay, well, 
simple. It's just, are you hitting more of the things that you hit in training than without it? That's the that's the easiest way to like work it out. The um, only thing I solo practice is like, if I don't know how to hit something, I will hit it once ever in solo practice, and then I'll be like, okay, now I can take it into the. Oh, no, nah, you got to do more than once. You, you got to you have to you have to do it consistently. There's a reason why like, uh, PPMD. Even if he was like, um, even if he could do something right in practice. Um, he wouldn't do it in tournament matches until he was like 99% confident that, oh sorry, like uh, pretty 100% confident he could get it 99 of 100 times. He wouldn't do it unless he was like confident that like it was worth like. So doing. I gotta stop Gosu drop. I gotta stop attempting Gosu drops. In yeah, in there. games, absolutely. <laughs> you have to stop. I'm dead serious about that. Um, because basically like. You just want to repeat the situation over and over again. That's what practice is for. And then, like, when you play, you know, friendlies online or whatever, um, then you can, like, How do you test your consistency, so basically. Bored, are you not bored when you do it? Are you not like, this is the worst, I hate doing this? this Turn off forever. your phone. Like... You want me to live in the moment? Yeah, literally. You, you actually just want to be like... You know, this video game was made for me to enjoy. What's a ghostly drop, Caleb? The ghostly drop is uh, what's about to differentiate you and me. I'm sorry. What is the ghostly drop? Please explain. So there's a character, there's a player named Gosu. I think he's digital. He plays on digital. And I accidentally did this thing, and I was like, wait, has no one ever done this before? This is so cool. And I googled it, and some guy named Gosu did it before me. I okay? see. Basically, it's like a way to grab ledge um, without turning your character around very obviously and being like, hey, I'm taking ledge from you. Are, I, I just want to like. Are you talking when you like dash dash and it drops into the ledge? It's like that, but without the dash dancing at ledge. That 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 is a mechanic of go through dropping, but it's specifically like carrying momentum from a short hop, and like you kind of slide across the ground, and then you instantly turn around, pick, like and just grab ledge, and then like you like, depending on the situation, you like refresh invincibility, or you like I don't know. I oh, got so that you, you get it by going into jump squat, facing the opposite way. Maybe. Like facing the ledge, right? I don't know. I just press buttons. I don't no, know. No, no, no. That's what I'm wondering. It's like you do, you do your short hop, and then you. you it's the landing. It's not the. Sh it's not oh, the, it's not the landing. It's oh, the landing okay. Sure, sure, sure. That licks you down. Uh, I slide. Okay, I, I kind of picking it up. Yeah. Uh, sure. And uh, it's not like the most intuitive. Great. This is gonna change my game plan. It's just like I saw it. I thought it was cool. Okay, cool. So that's like the thing I've been doing, but like I don't know. I, I should probably solo practice like sheep punish. Yeah. So like, see, this is what I, like I mean now that we're two stocks to one on this stage. Like Kyle's got a lot of percent here. Gonna he take one that. fair, and that's gonna be over Those or, forward, or like so a forward desperate. throw. Oh, um, that's like basically me. like at this point, um, this is oh my god. Like I'm j all I'm thinking is that I don't think Kyle's been in the situation where. You know what? I've sat at home for 30 minutes once in my life with against a peach and practiced my punish game. And you think McLeod's been in that situation? And I think McLeod has. So I just don't want to be surprised mid-match. Yeah, I've done it you un yes, 100%. You just want to be able to like let your body do the work for you. You don't want to have to think about doing it. But then how do you beat someone who's played the game more than you? What do you mean? Just be more practiced that day? Well, not only be more practiced, but also like... Um, oh, but play neutral and stuff as well, on top of all that. How you beat someone is like, you don't assume that they're going to be playing their best 100% of the time in the match. You have Muscat now. Yep. Good luck. Thank you. Yeah, Muscat just got a haircut. Please do not bring it up in chat. No, sorry, I was talking to chat. I was just saying, do not bring up Muscat's haircut in chat. Oh, you are banned. So, I don't I don't want to see any of the Muscat hair. <laughs> so, like, you beat someone who's played more than you by playing... You beat someone... Okay, this is how you beat someone. You um, playing your own game. Wait. Did this happen again? Are you? I didn't uh, set the socks right. Like, I didn't, what is this? I didn't this, change this, it. This, are you cheating? You can change this? Uh, it's not. I don't think that the box the box doesn't have this kind of uh, functionality. I don't think. As in, I used the not broken one, and I had the broken one, which I'm no longer used to, because I used the not broken one. Right. So I have to. I just have to set it to the not broken one. Oh, we load. So basically, Kyle would have won that. But you're just like a filthy cheater? Uh, I definitely play worse because my character doesn't move how I expected to. Oh, oh, so what you're saying is you would have 3-0'd, yeah. but... 
I couldn't tell if you meant broken. See, I, I've been talking to somebody who says broken exclusively as a good thing. Oh, no, as in... You mean I, broken? I, like I, I had the broken oh, one. We have a match, I think. Oh, yeah, Would you go like ahead. to play right now? Go, shoot. Uh, I believe so. Do I have this wrong? I think I might. Um, Hello? Hi. My settings are wrong. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna lie, that last game I was like, okay, we take a stop, another stop. Yeah, you did good at holding on. I didn't, yeah, I didn't want to be there. Um, oh yeah, you look like you just wanted to shoot yourself at times. Yeah, that's okay. Um, no, um, I Kill yourself, Caleb. Anyway. <laughs> Thank you, Caleb. Why You're is this not fans? loading? Okay, whatever, I have to reset everything. Whatever. Dumb. This is X, this is Y. I was definitely hoping to get a hit in, like... Last stock, like surely. Yeah, it's no, hard. no, it was good. You actually, you know, you had good composure, and I'm just like, I let it end, and you're like, no, and I'm like, fuck you. I, like, I respect that. No, uh, I was like, you know what? I, I just want to see how much I can eat out. Yeah, no, that's that's exactly how you should be. Yeah. Um, this is Z. Cause you could have won that game, like for sure. I always forget the arc, it, the way it is, like in the middle of it, it goes over. Yeah. I'm like this is gonna cover. It didn't cover. Yeah, I, I didn't feel like I knew anything I was doing in the Peach matchup, which is probably my fault for not having played first Peach in many weeks. I mean, not we, really playing the game. I, I would, I'd say people. Um, like, I haven't played the matchup either. I was definitely yeah. thinking I am getting my ass handed to me if, like, she's been playing the matchup at all. I have not. Uh, this was neutral socks. I'm pretty sure left, right, up he. I think these are both neutral. From memory. I'm pretty sure that's my right settings. If it's not, well, I'll kill myself. Hell yeah. Can I have a front row seat? You don't mean that. Aww. You might not want to... You, you can lean into me, but yeah. like... Oh, the sweat stain? The, the, the swamp pits? Uh, but to answer your question, how the swagman set go? Um, to a... Not really sure much else to say. Alright. I think I'm a corpse. <laughs> uh, I think that's more of a me thing than a Kyle thing, but yeah, it's definitely, uh, it's probably exaggerated. I mean, we both have, like, a certain pact if we, like, lose to uh, Anthony and Jack. <laughs> yeah, if we thing. lose to Anthony and Jack at, uh, at the Big Cheese, we're suicide packing. packing. Mm. Uh, we can plug this back in, I guess. <laughs> literally put a time on. That's amazing, actually, Jack. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> yeah, I think I just gotta recognize I'm tired and like try my best because I think I was fighting it in that set and it didn't go very well. Tired, trying your best, controller not trying its best, you know. Yeah, no, it's just my fault. Like, I'm just a bitch. So I'll try not to be a bitch and whatever my next set is. I'd be real, but I thought there was actually something wrong with your controller. Which yeah, there was, but it still was like a small thing. It oh, was really? Mostly fine. Oh, did, my character just like randomly didn't. Honestly, Yosh, tempting, but I'll just play tired and still. I'm actually, because I, I try to have caffeine like once a week for like workout stuff. So today I probably should have considered my workout, but I had it like three days ago. So I'm like, all right, well actually, I don't want to get, I don't want to get addicted to it. Or reliant on it. It's a once a week thing. So I will just, uh, I literally didn't drink caffeine until last year. At all, ever, for the first 25 years of my life. You never so, had tea? Not really. Oh. Like, I might have had it here and there, but I just never did it. That's fair. But, uh, yeah, I only started drinking caffeine, like, this year, really. Properly. But, yeah. <laughs> I do know how that went. Uh, what's happening? Oh, uh, you lost? Oh, yeah, 2 hour. Let's go Moonlight. Hold on. I'm proud of you, Swag. You'll have loser of 8, which is uh, this. Um, we shall update the scores, I guess. It's Kai. Over oh, yeah, we should probably, like, change the view. <laughs> I kind of, kind of, yeah, not doing anything. Thank you. I was about to. Trust. What a Trust. Greatest. Let's cap. 
Oh uh, wow, won? we really haven't updated shit. <laughs> was it Kai? I, I saw I saw Kyle still there. Yeah, that's okay. We did it. Are you proud of us? Are we the best? Uh, uh, Kai probably set this bracket. Here you go. Ready? There you go. In caps lock. For you, crystalline aim. <laughs> what do you mean, choke? I got 3 0 down. It's good. You never want to win the pre local, Kyle. I've, I've been telling people, you don't want to win the pre local. It's, it's not good for you. Oh no, I think it's a nice boost. Uh, it's, it's not. You just lose after. You lose in the main event, you're really sad. Yeah, but like, you win the main event, like, top 8 or like. Yeah, but you don't. What well, if you do? Yeah, but you don't. That's the problem. If you did, it would be great, but you don't. Well, I mean, no I one's don't. ever won the pre local and then won the event after. It's facts. I've never done it. I've never seen Sog done it. I've never seen anyone do it. All I've right. never seen anyone win a pre local and then win the event. Alright, sis. What? That's that. I, I genuinely, from my experience <laughs> of like so six pre locals, they've never, they've never won the event. Or like come top eight. Oh, duh. Like the people who are winning the pre local is like fucking like me, Sog, we all, Of course we might make top eight, but we don't win. I know. Oh, d fucking duh, Caleb. Uh, no count Josh. Josh is a different creature. Also, I don't think Josh like enters pre locals uh, other than the um, the Phantom one, I guess. Oh, no. My perspective is definitely different. Since if I like get top 8 or whatnot, that's like. You know, if it happens at some point, that may jump. I'm happy. I'm very happy. You have to understand that Josh doesn't exist in my mind when I'm like talking about Australia. It's like Australians and then Josh. Like, they're, they're, they're separate concepts. When I'm talking about these concepts, I don't mean Josh. Because we are bad, and Josh is not quite as bad. I'm actually thinking about how all teachers, like, share the same brain cell. Yeah, it's real. If R Riz would have got that shine, for sure. Honestly, I think every character, like, they share the same sort of brain cells between each other. He's so smart! They're so smart. I don't know. I'm also tired. Smart. Uh, I can't think of things to say. I'm also kind of tired. <laughs> I'm I'm about to fall asleep. Which I I'm gonna. I don't know. I wanna. It's a good test. I wanna see how I play tired and like ego field from floating point. I'm gonna try now. I'll try to shed it the best I can. See how I go. Have fun. I, I did like my workout earlier. Nice. You just, you just hold the, the things up, and then you walk around a little bit. Well, I just I, when I do it, I just stand generally because so it's, I'm that's, watching that's, a video. That's a farmer's stand, not a farmer's walk. Oh, well, I mean, what is actually the difference? Because I'm still holding. One's a walk. You want one, you walk. Well, one is like but the point of it is core stabilization. Because when you walk, you have to balance either side. That it feels easier to walk with it than to stand. Well, they're both quite easy. So. Yeah, but like <laughs> one feels easier. And also, I want to watch something on the computer, so I have my headphones on, yeah. each dumbbell in hand. That's kind of a workout. We're well, trying our best it's here. Not, okay, it, for everyone listening, that's not do, all I could, fucking do. What else did you do? Um, I know, just, like, uh, pulling them. You just, you just pulled them? Pull, I'm trying to, like, work out other areas of my body as yeah, well. Yeah, so you just, you just fl I'm fly the weights around in the... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what is happening in these workouts? I know. Well, you're just like doing actions with your arms, and I'm, I'm like, what is this? What are, like, I want to work out other areas. I'm like, what are we working? Do we have any idea what we're doing? Um, triceps, shoulders, chest. I just don't know the names of whatever the hell I'm doing, but I am feeling it. I love, I love you guys. Look, all that all you need to know is that like I'm feeling at the areas I'm targeting. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> We're trying our best out here. <laughs> We're getting stronger. In a PT, Miranda is absolutely fucking throwing her off seven buildings. Hey, we're, hey, we're doing <laughs> we're doing the lateral <laughs> Hey there we go, that's like a real exercise. <laughs> what about if it gets me there? What about if it Where's there? I don't it, know. It, 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 it will, you will greatly improve at your ability to laterally raise four kilos and hold four kilos. It's five. Five. 
I like to under 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 value, but yeah, you you you'll become better at holding five kilos. Is what if you if you oh. all right? So Kyle, if you hold five kilos a lot, yeah, you are now better at holding five kilos. It's so I can get stronger. Build yeah, but you're better at holding five kilos. You're not. It doesn't translate as well as like you have to you have to up it. And you have to play around. I with know, it to, to but like I don't think I don't think I'm at the point where like I need to like really think about upping it, especially if. Since I only have one set of dumbbells. Yeah. Um, there's other there's other exercises you can do with dumbbells. Yeah. And like, and like some some um, some muscles are definitely more developed than others. And well, regardless, I don't think I need to up it right now. I can always do more reps or have like less of a rest period in between sets. I like thought about. It. I was like, oh, I have to play Kai. I'm like, oh, that will make me. Yeah, I have. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, I know. I saw. Uh, <laughs> I have. Uh, I need. A, I need to get heavier. I have uh, ankle weights. Um, I need. Yeah, I need like heavier ankle weights, but they're good. Dude. Oh uh, yeah, I was thinking about it. I'm like, I think playing Kai will make me want to kill myself. And I thought about it more. I'm like, playing Muscat will also make me want to kill myself. Like, playing the game. It's fine. That. Yeah. It's like one of those nights. Yeah. I'm like way more tired than I thought. I should go climbing. Um, maybe when I get a job, because. Shit's expensive. Have you been before? You have what? I have. Oh, that's sad. Because I can, I, I can get people who've never been in once for free. Well, I mean, I, I've been under as Catherine. I've never been as Kyle. Oh, true. We can just sign you up new. But I, I don't know if that works. I, well, you, I mean, you could, but you'd have to get, you have to get Swifty or that. I mean, it's not, it's I don't not think lie. they check your ID. It's not. I can't remember. Yeah, I'm pretty sure they don't. Wow, Moscow actually clutched that. That's crazy. I mean, I am literally, you know different person in a sense. Kind of. I'm just a guy. <laughs> I mean you could. What is this woman? Well, I'm trying to think of how they sign up. I don't think they take ID, so yeah, you probably could. Yes. Right, I could get you into free. I don't know, it's good. I went today for like two hours in death. I tried to run after and I ran like a third of the way and I collapsed. When I say collapsed, I mean I just was a bitch and I gave up. Me when I run for any amount of time. Yeah. Okay, I want to be a runner again. I'm gonna start like running every day and then like gradually increase the length. So I'm annoyed at not being a runner. Whenever I run now, I'm just like, man, I should be fitter than this. And I'm not. It makes me sad. I mean, I get what you're saying, but like, I can't relate. Running, you have to understand. Like, if you you if you ever get to the point, you should because it's sick. If you ever get to the point where you're like actually fit and like running feels good. You can just keep running. It's fucking amazing. Like genuinely, like ridiculously amazing feeling. And just like the feeling of being fit feels really good. Yeah, but like I'm not gonna lie. If I'm gonna be exercising, there's just things I much prefer to do. Yeah, that's fine. And that's like what I thought. Well, like that's what I did for years. And I'm just like I'm not that big a running fan. And I like started running again. I'm like, oh yeah, I kind of am. Kind of grows on you. It. Oh, no, for me it doesn't. Like well, that's because you've done two minutes. It's not. It's just a little bit. I don't. I don't mean it grows on you. And like, it's a slow grower. It's not a fast grower. It's a. You've been running for a year grower. I think. Yeah. I know. Like it. I. I know. I just know what I like to do with exercise. It's not cardio. You don't yet. You don't really, you don't really learn what you like to do for exercise until you're like into it further. Ah oh, no, I'm, I can say weightlifting is pretty fun. Yeah. That's exercise. Yeah. You also, yeah, that's good. It's a good start. Like I know cardio is healthy for you. I am well aware of the benefits of running. I just can't be bothered. Yeah, I know. I was, I was never screaming you on any of that. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, we'll get that. Oh yeah, my volleyball arc of one session. I I do want to go back. We'll go. I uh, will figure it out at some point. Oh, that was almost insane combo. Muscat's a real hold-in demon. I met the volleyball guy in the city, like the guy who runs the the one I went to. And he's like, hi. I was like, oh, we want you back. And I'm like, oh, that's sweet. I actually do kind of want to back We'll see. I think, but the problem with volleyball for me is I like, I need to have a stable team to be having fun. Like playing with randoms, I don't think it's going to cut it for very long. I kind of just like need to have a role and like need to be able to like 
time to build. Because it's like, if getting the ball like once every like five shots and then like having one shot at it is just not very satisfying for me. Kai has been like reversal before they're able to kill Muscat for the 10th time in this game. I have not been paying attention. What do you mean it's not the game for? What happened? Uh, Muscat clutched up to be honest. I'm not asking why he's ahead, I'm just asking how. I love you Muscat. That's the hardest character in the game, everybody. Oof. Good night. Alright, we can play a loser's game or two. Oh shit, is it my loser's game? That's a... <laughs> <laughs> I love... <laughs> it did look like one of those sets. Uh, I get it. I, like every, I, I was like looking at it. I was kind of looking at the screen and, and, and absorbing it without looking at the screen. And like, I understand Kai's reaction based on what I observed. I just saw the up smash, I was like, yeah, I, I don't understand. Uh, we'll do, we'll do a little bit of losers. Uh, Kyle, yellow, has yellow Riz happened? Uh, I'm pretty sure. Yes, what, well, yellow one? Okay, you have yellow whenever. I have to play this game. Uh, if yellow has a game, oh. then we will play. Oh, you have Kai, Kai swag. But Kai is about to shoot himself. Okay, so I'm just gonna. I'm, we're just gonna play winners because I can't be fucked. Sure. And there's like five min missing things. And if any, anyone has like a game, just send them to their game. So you have yellow, I think? Yeah. Is that what we just determined? I, yeah, because yellow Riz playing, yellow one, and then. Yeah, so you have yellow and Kai has swag. Yeah. Uh, I can just play off stream. Off stream? Alright, sure. Well, I'll just stay here until yellow decides to exist again. Oh my god, I'm gonna have to do something with my life right now. That's crazy. No further when I can just zone out. Let McLeod handle everything. <laughs> oh hey, yeah, I don't have to change Anthony's side. That's great. What color are we going today? Uh, neutral in this matchup feels so weird because either either like kind of be crouching in like these weird spots, but like also also Nair's just a really good move, but you have to be in the air to do that. And then like there's this whole using Nair to catch up Fox jump, like especially when he's in the corner. Then if you do it too much, then they can play around there. There's just a lot to unpack. I'm still doing it. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting there at least. Like, getting bits and pieces. Like, it'd be more efficient if I actually did practice, but I think just friendlies trying to implement stuff. It's definitely like the slow burn way of getting better. It's definitely been how I've danced down for this. Um, yeah, the slow burn way of getting better. It's definitely how I've managed a lot of my career. Just, I'd rather have fun instead of really practice. And like, it just feels like a lot of times it's enough. Like at least just what I would consider the base. I'd want to do like every local and stuff like 
beat people below me. Um, I am happy to. I, I would like to actually, you know, be kind of not anything, but I think until I actually won enough, I'm just content like this. Oh yeah, you are right, Caleb. <laughs> He's wearing the same for the spot. No? I don't know. I, I know it sounds cringe, but like... I just don't really have like this game as like a priority in my life. I think more recently it's just been more just coming here to have fun, talk with the gamers, the lads, the losers, free genders. Yeah, it's great. Thank you, guy. I always forget to do that. <laughs> Sometimes it's just nice having this game on in the background. Like, it's just there, even if like, you're not heavily paying attention to it. It's just the sounds, the amusement, happenings. It's just like a sense of community for me at least. Yo, I've been there. <laughs> I love Peach because like you think you can't SD and she's a floaty or like it shouldn't happen, but like we find the funniest ways to lose a star all by ourselves. <laughs> I think honestly the most um Ready Go Ah I was gonna say something. Oh yeah, the, the thing honestly I'm most like completely excited for <laughs> is double. <laughs> it's melee but like extra wacky. Oh so please forgive me, I think I'm having like a brain aneurysm right now. <laughs> oh jeez. <laughs> Save Musket's haircut three times, he appears out from the corner. You don't want to know what happens after that. You think if I said it three times, something would happen if I said Musket's haircut? Like, repeatedly. <laughs> <laughs> what? Musky's haircut too. Can we get a third? Musky's haircut three. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure someone's already said, but the reason why his hair looks like that is because. Went to a barber and like gave the numbers. I want to say five, four or something. I don't know. I have no idea how men's hair works. Anyway, so apparently his barber just like had a mistake, maybe misheard, and just like started trimming it too short. And then by that point, you just have to like keep it like that, make it symmetrical. Yeah, that's why I got a new haircut. Hey, Riz. Hey, how are you, Carl? Good. I'm just waiting for Yo to exist so I can play the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ultimate problems. Entering two brackets at once. Ult yeah. Let's be honest here. I feel like I need to play more ultimate. I feel like I would refine my game plan a bit more. If you just, like, have any more exposure to 
not just like the genre of whatever platform fighters are, but just gaming in general. Anyway. It's not you, Olaf. <laughs> Did you see them? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> you know what, I don't even think Muscat's haircut, haircut is that bad, let's be honest here. I feel like in the scale of bad haircuts, speaking as an Asian person, mm, we've suffered the worse. Wow. Yep. Oh. Let's see. Yep, that's it. Yeah, that was game two I tried, updating it and... Game two? McLeod is currently 2-0 up. Yeah. So... I don't just know, it's not letting me update, but... Yeah. This is game three. It's interesting to see the way that McLeod is... Uh, not McLeod, that Muscat is playing the kind of matchup. You know, Stadium is pretty good for a number of reasons. Uh, number one is that you can raise a camp like this. Uh, but, like, you, what you have to really do is make sure that those shines lead to an edge guard mix up. And you saw earlier on, you saw wave shine, wave shine, double shine, and into grab ledge. What you can actually do is instead of doing the double shine, what you've got to do is, uh, like, wave shine into dash, JC shine, try and catch them in, uh, miss, not miss foot, it's, um, there's a specific animation when they're fast falling to ledge, they're like, there's like two frames where they're just not actionable at all. And you can time it in order to uh, kill them there. And if the shine doesn't, if like the wave shine, uh, like JC shine doesn't come out fast enough, you can wave shine jab or uh, wave shine dash attack. And that's kind of like where the end game of that goes. So every shine should basically lead to Either, you know, they SDI out, in which case there's, like, there are mix-ups off of it. Uh, but, like, there, see, that up smash is, like, that is my level of play, where it's just, you know, I don't want to mess with letting them go to ledge just like that. So just up smash them for the percent. But it's, like, I don't know. I feel like you can very clearly see the next thing that Muscat needs to work on is getting it at the <laughs> ledge there. Uh, T-O-D-R. You want to hit more shines, Garfield, especially you, you on... You weren't listening, so I can say it all again? I'd love to. So basically, this matchup, the punish game, <laughs> Fox's punish game, boils <laughs> down to whenever you get a shine, you have to wave shine them to the ledge and then shine them at the ledge so that they go off stage so that you can get a very advantage mix-up because Peach Cat is horrid off the stage. So you wave shine them off. There's an animation when they fast forward to ledge where they... Uh, not actionable for two frames and you just shine them or jab them or dash attack them there. Or um, actually there's down tilt as well. There's a lot of weird niche uh, kind of tech uh, in the Fox Peach matchup and interestingly there was one set uh, KJH versus what's the one Peach main that's good? KJH uh, versus B-Bats I think. Oh um, fuck a bomb. Yeah. Um, <laughs> anyway, so KJH versus B Bats. Uh, go check it out if you're interested in this matchup at all. KJH is really, um, really well versed in it. Strangely, there's a lot of tech. Like, uh, there's one tech called the Sheik Killer, but it also works against like uh, Peaches Up B, where you buff a Light Shield as you grab Ledge, which means that you can uh, like OS a uh, Ledge, uh, Ledge roll, and a uh, tech to ledge, like you tech a um, peach up B and then immediately jump shine. Uh, yeah, Muscat <laughs> takes a game. Ooh, I mean, game it looks good. It looks pretty like clinical. I don't think there's anything exceptional coming from either side. But yeah, I think that uh, honestly, it's I don't know. I've n actually, now that I think about it, I have never seen these two play each other. I was, last night, I was watching uh, sets, I think it was like, I was like watching mostly Marth Dittos. Like, ah. because I started with, um, with Zane versus M2K. Then I just started watching other Marth Dittos. But I was thinking like, oh, I should check out like SA Smash, try and check out all of the old McLeod Muscat matches, and I just didn't get around to it. But, uh, 
Yeah, Sheet Killer does work. Uh, but there are, like, certain recoveries where, like, uh, specifically as Fox, getting, like, the wall jump tech shine is, like, more or less consistent. But, yeah. I don't know. You've seen this matchup many a time. How does yes. it normally go? You mean between these two players? Or yeah. just like, oh. Um, kind of generally wins. So I have these actually taken. Set top for. Um, I think what happens a lot of times is just... I will get a lead and it's just really hard. This match in general. To just, um, take it back sometimes. Because Peach is really good. They're just staying in, like, the safety corner. And, like, you do have to approach, even if you keep shooting lasers, you still have to land something. Yeah. Like, back here. I probably should have... that works into up smash and whatnot. I probably should have clarified, like, I was talking more about the player matchup, but, uh, Caleb Video Games, what is the sheet killer? When you grab the ledge, if you press shield, you'll ledge roll. Uh, but as you grab the ledge, during the seven frames where you're inactionable, you can buffer a light shield input, and if you press the shield button, you won't ledge roll, but if you get hit, uh, you'll, like, option select a wall tech. So, you can, like, um, you can press shield and not do the roll animation, and instead you can do a, uh, a tech. So, basically, you use that in order to, when Peach is up being, normally Fox is, like, if once the intangibility wears off, Fox can get hit by it, reversing super easily. But if you instead of holding light shield as you grab the ledge, you can press shield and you can uh, buffer a tech against the wall and then immediately shine, and that will kill. Oh god, it's so, game five. Yeah. So I meant more. How does the McLeod Muscat matchup normally go? Oh. Because I feel like there is like a large degree of player matchup. I mean, I guess. Uh, Anthony generally plays this match uh, more carefully, like, likes to shoot a lot. And uh, is definitely willing to just like find either when he just makes a mistake or when Fox just has to come down. Yeah, Muscat is playing quite defensively from what I can see. There's a. Uh, I know. Muscat, the movement on platforms has been really nice. It, yeah, it doesn't matter, but I really do appreciate the movement. Is, can you put everything you just said into a Peter Griffin AI voice? Unfortunately, I cannot because I can't remember it. Um, yeah. Man, Giant's a pretty good move when you can yeah, fucking jump out of it. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. Yeah. I just kind of shit, started shitting everywhere at the end of that pod game. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I don't know, whatever. Yeah, go now. That's that's the only game we have. We got an exciting one. We got a, we got a nice <laughs> cool down <laughs> in between sets. Well, we have... I stream Yellow Riz. So Yellow Riz played. I'm going to... Yellow, what was the score of your reset? 2-1. 2-1. Uh, hmm. <sighs> Kai swag is happening. That could, that could just crazy things could happen tonight. We might see another uh, another headphone toss and a headphone toss and a seven controller re recalibrates after that. Mary, why does Muskie's hair cut? You know what? You can, you can ask Muskie himself. Um, why does my hair look, look like that? I'll tell you why. I'll tell the stream why, in fact. So I went to my barber. I'm not a particularly fussy person when I get my... Because I stole the top of my hair. I just want to cut to a... Trim to a certain length with trimmer. And, um, you know, blend it a little bit at the top. Nothing fancy. It's something like a 7, maybe an 8, lengthwise on the um, trimmer styled afterwards and then um, four or five on the sides. I get in. I'm a little tired. Not really paying attention. I also don't have my glasses on when I get my hair cut so I can barely see. But I could see this. I started like trimming. I'm like, no, wait, this is too short. 
<laughs> he used a fucking five on my hair. Butchered it. It's cut so short. Um, that point there's no saving it, so I'm like, just, just do it all. Just do it. Just cut it. Like trim it short. Okay, Maskin, my boy. <laughs> to answer the second half of your question, Chaos, yes, that's why I lost the stadium. Um, nah, I mean, I've done short hair before. It's okay. It's like... I like my line. I was... <laughs> what, was what, did they, what did they say? Um, it looks fine. But when I look in the mirror, it's not who I want, it's not who I want to be. And quite frankly, I'm not, sure as many I'm not sure as many people can relate that. That's that. a very, no. very, uh... It's very me. It's a very Muscat, uh... Specific thing, problem. yep. Who in the Smash scene can relate? Oh my god, Blonde Muscat? Oh blonde my god. <laughs> oh my god, Blonde... Oh my god, that's... I kinda, I kinda see it. I, I see the, the vision, Cass. I see the vision. Take the glasses off, well, guess what? <laughs> Maybe at some point. Take the glasses off, get Contact. some... Dyed, do some Cindy. Cindy dyed his hair at, uh... For, uh um... Point. Firefox last year. <laughs> we, we get the dye out for you too. I um. We have to get the five out. <laughs> I um. Think about glasses. Is that um. They hide my raccoon, which I do. I do like my raccoon eyes, but like the um shadows under my eyes are a lot more prominent. Handshake emoji. Yep. Um. Ninety percent of my makeup is to hide the shadows under. <laughs> Wait, really? I'm not even joking. I actually. Yeah, I am. Yeah. My, yeah look, at my, my, look, my, look at this. Oh yeah. Yeah. yeah no, I'm yep. familiar. Yep. It's. Yeah, literally, literally, ninety percent of the point of my makeup is to is to hide the shadows under my eyes, and also the forehead I'm getting rid of. Yep. But you know, Tubby. Sometimes we're a little tired. Thanks. Mm. I get makeup to hide that though. <laughs> yeah, it's, yeah it's the ups and downs of having makeup is it doesn't show how you how tired you are. That's it's like you you could look like an absolute corpse. You could be on my ass, sleep, you look fine. That's a classic, like, right? When someone's right? not wearing makeup, I'm like, well, you look tired. Yeah. <laughs> You're yep, so tired. Yep. I'm like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, I don't know. I actually I'd love to see a yellow kill off this hand off right now. And oh, kind of. Not right. What? Yeah, he's no longer my barber. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> That's the GG. Yep. I love the light shield there. Yeah, actually though. Like yellow looks fine in this matchup. Just like play it. Kels is better than you. It's chill. Kels also not good at this matchup. Contrary to Winning the last Mason set, as as what well, as, as Kyle has set the bar for being good at this matchup. Kyle, I mean that's look, Kyle. Um, Kyle's a man of many matchups. Icy, Sheik, Puff, and that's just that just gives him the edge against Mason. Yeah, they've both picked like. Yo, I hasn't tried uh, Sheik yet. Yep. Let's see, Let's see how long that takes. Could work. Probably wouldn't work. No, it could work. Probably not. <laughs> I honestly think like the ICs, if oh, yeah. if he Ice gets it to the point where he's like taking games with Kyle, he, he yellow's just farming every other piece in the country or something. Yep. Like straight up. This they is also, not like none of them have played in ice climbers before. Uh, quarters? I'm gonna guess it's quarters. And none of them are also good. Quarters did quarters. Just, just, just send it. Whatever it comes out, it's yeah, quartered. yeah, fine. It's quartered. Fine. That's right. Whatever it comes out, that's that's what God intended. Okay. Oh no. Where's the, where's the, oh, there we are. We found it. All right, losers quartered. That's kind of fucked, actually. <laughs> oh, you're gonna have to. You're gonna have to scores. Scoreboard. Uh, not the, the HTML. Oh, there you go. HTML. HTML. There we go. We got it. We can read. Right, losers quartered. Loses All right. Quartered. It's kind of fucked. It is kind of fucked. What happened over there, Swag? Did you get them? Nice. What well, is that? What's pretty good? Yeah. I put three over pretty good. There is no pretty good. That's you have one over this. So, yeah. I'm also thankful for the ice climbers because the games are shorter. God, what's up? See, look, this, it's fine. Like, Yellow could take this first dog. Like, I'm not going to here, but. Uh, could drop down and get an up smash. It's changing our, changing our era. <laughs> no, we liked Quartered. Oh, go on. Oh, no, it's plus five. It was just round one. Round one loses, wasn't Oh, yeah, sure. Oh my god, that confuses me every time. Oh, 
What are we doing? Oh, yeah, okay. Try things. I trust them. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not gonna. No. Yeah, I'm just like, let him. Yes, stream. Any problems with it? Go ahead. Yep. I ain't gonna fix them. I'm not gonna mansplain uh, stream stuff. <laughs> not? Hell no. Only mirror but issues. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Nice work. Oh, that was a good air dodge. God, I see jab grab is silly. Mm. Oh, that, was, that was a cute little sequence. The grab's a bit risky, though. That was good. Yeah, yours actually. Like, relative, when I say good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, if a very close um, best of five win against a bard, I'm pretty sure is a person that exists. Like, Wollongong's best or second best player. So, yeah. <laughs> what was that law? <laughs> this game. <laughs> what? <laughs> What's that? <laughs> number one? Okay, nice. That's actually number one and where? Mm. I reckon Yellow would do pretty good against, like, Northern Territories number one, too. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong. <laughs> no, that wasn't really a joke. It was just, it was just yeah. a statement of no. Yeah. Oh, what happened? That's what I'm saying. No, that's that was our export. There's actually some lovely people in the world. I'm sure. Yeah. Yeah. I had no comments on. I had no comments on their personality. I'm sure they're beautiful people. Mm. I've heard, in fact, that they are beautiful people. Mm -hmm. Gameplay. The bell <laughs> Isn't it like a really old scene? Developing. <laughs> <laughs> Every scene's old. Like the what's in the get like Ride to Hell Retribution ten years in development? <laughs> what's <laughs> 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 We're working on it. Wait, that game that game is actually sick though. That game is um <laughs> that game is I agree. I, I think Jesse, Jack my soul, have played it like at least two or three times. That's insane. Like, no, no. the one I understand, the two or three, that's that's no. That's, it's, that's it's, I think it's probably two. I think we did it once, and um, then we tried. No, it would have been it, the first. It would have been like two and a half. First <laughs> time was on um, badass biker, which is the normal, <laughs> the normal mode, and then there's one percenter, which is the hard mode. And that mode is fucked because there's some really bullshit sections. And then um, at some point we tried getting it, playing it again, like. Eight years later on PC, and that had its own issues. But um, dude, that no, that <laughs> it's so bad. It's such a shit game, but it's so funny. It's like a, sh and there's some games that are like shitty movies, but like they're just still very unenjoyable to play. This one hits just, it's just shit enough, and some of the mechanics like kick is broken. Do you just kick? You're meant to be shooting people, or, like hitting them with melee weapons, but kick just ton locks enemies. <laughs> so you just kick them eight times. Yeah, that you, seems relevant. So you get to like a grapple, and he just has. <laughs> also, the textures don't load in until like halfway through the cutscene. I'll always remember the New Year's. That was Kong Skull oh, Island. Yeah. <laughs> I enjoyed the Kong, I enjoyed Kong Skull Island. Damn definitely. straight, you told yourself up for. Uh, well, I Kong Skull Island. Kong, Kong Sky <laughs> <Island>. <laughs> 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 It was worth every every second. It was as yeah. we faded in, as we as we uh, faded through the floor into a locked area. I don't think we ever unlocked. No, we. Not. I, think I don't might. think. I don't know how that works. I don't know how do we unlock it. That might have ended it. That might have. I no, I, I just remember oh, no, it was a zone. Out. It, it was, was a zone, yeah. and we played like four more hours, and we never got to oh. that zone. I was really disappointed. I was like, when do we get... And like, it, it implied more powers. More power. Yeah, yeah. Like, I wonder yeah. if it was like we dropped into an undeveloped area of the game <laughs> that was like meant to be... That would have been crazy. That would have actually... So. Um, because, yeah, it implied... It, it had skills we needed that we didn't have yet that I don't think we ever got. I also don't remember that much because I, I started... <laughs> <laughs> I was sober as... <laughs> was so I, was absor I was sober as hell. I was absorbing Skull, yep. Skull, Skull, Kong, Skull. Skull Island. I can talk. I swear. Yeah. Words are hard. <laughs> GG's. Yep. Can we have Kai Kyle? Kai E. Oh, you've got the, the, the iced tea again. Not the iced tea, whatever, the, the, the green tea. Is that the sour one or the sweet one? The sour one, I think. Salty? Yeah. 
don't know. Uh, Buck, yeah, yeah, I know, Buck. right? <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hater. What a cunt. No, I mean, just any time you play against Peach, it's like a moral victory if you can get within, like... <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just read Caleb's messages. <laughs> wow, project much. What I care about is <laughs> no one doing anything. <laughs> no way, let me read <laughs> This is so good. I'm never releasing a PI ever. Is there like, well, well, project much. What I care about is nobody else doing anything despite saying they will. When I post about it three times, I said, let's use Scalfie's PR, then Kai just to... Then Kai disagree with it and then say they will run the calc. So I'm like, okay, then nothing happens. So nothing. screw you. So screw you. Look, Caleb. It's okay. <laughs> Caleb, you can just... <laughs> what do you mean project much? Yep. You just said project much about me not caring about the PR and then you launch into a six paragraph rant. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Don't read DMs. Like, <laughs> Look, if there was anything actually sensitive or anything, you know... I would still read it on screen. It's clean, but I I'm not responding to that. <laughs> you still read it? <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, the other DMs is Kai asking me if I'll be on after the tournament. I mean, not as is uh, Chai asking me if I'm on after the tournament. So there you go, I've leaked all of my DMs yep. that are currently on my phone. Hopefully more don't come out, then I'll be forced to leak them. Kai two socks down. Yep. But these legends looking alright though. We're calibrated. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> Show up to a tournament, idiot, then maybe we'll make a PR. Yeah, I know. Surely you're done with Elden Ring by now. Maybe not. I mean, he said it'll be Friday, but you should, you should come anyway. Thomas rule. I will not be here Friday. I have D and D. I have work. Yep. <gasps> you, you, you get to watch your team go out in straight sets. Again. Again. <laughs> and then they'll get rid of Hinkley, and you'll get closure. And that's. That was a really funny statistic where it was like, for 16 years after they like, before they introduced the buy. I think like four teams, went, like it was like like between like four and eight teams went out in straight sets in 16 years, and in the last since the buy came in eight years ago, every year a team has gone out in straight sets. Damn. So it's uh the buy changes consistency. It's interesting. It's it it kind of fascinating. Probably and I bet like three of three or four of those is Port Adelaide. <laughs> So. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so maybe we skewed the statistics a little bit by literally losing every motor function as soon as it, as soon as the word finals appears Finally. on the screen. It's just, it's just like you know all those melee players that just like as soon as they're, they're just like fine players and as soon as you just like it says set above their head they just forget how to breathe. Yeah, that's what I like. <laughs> 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 it's like literally just like. It's like, where are we guys? What game do we play? What? What's our game plan? Well, I don't know. <laughs> do we get paid six figures for this? Yeah, we do. Some seven. Aww. That's it. Some. Aww. I wonder what Charlie Dixon's on. I hope it's not seven. Because, God, he touched the ball twice. Yep. But what a twice. <laughs> that's a, th How many figures per finals touch would that be? <laughs> that's, that's like... That dude's making like 500k per finals touch. Yeah. Damn. Well, maybe, maybe when he gets two more, like next game, he'll get like. It'll really oh, be true. like. It'll be 250. <laughs> Yay. Yay. Nah, I love DD. Um, going back to that, I just like. There's been a nice. few one shots. Nah, nah. That's not nah, nah. So I just, get to, um, I just get to make like a bunch of different silly character nice. voices. I love um. that. I have to do DD with Smash People at some point. I've been lazy for many years. The person I play D and D with, like, is kind of like normally, is like kind of disconnected since my transition, which is a little sad. Oh, that's a shame. Can your haircut be a new character, Anthony? Look, we have um, what's my characters? I have old man, like seen our old man. I have um, oh, I had the Valley Girl NPC. <laughs> I had um. Well, that's what you're training your girl voice for. It <laughs> makes her back in the oz. It, the it was the D&D &D campaign. Ah, oh, so uh, yes, yes. No, no. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, uh, so true. Yep. Uh, anything? Oh, Kai's Ooh. killed himself? So hard. 
<laughs> I don't know how you right. kill. Like that was like three separate things you had to do wrong to kill yourself in that interaction. I think we should recalibrate. <laughs> Can you imagine mid game? Just bring up the, just turn the wheel, bring up the recalibrator. Oh, imagine like, imagine you get a win. Like imagine you lose. Say like Kai wins that game, and it just like switches over, re goes to recalibrate for like a minute. I would actually be. <laughs> no, we're done. We're done. We're yeah, done. I, that's a, that's a DQ. Then. Yep. Yep. My down button can fly out in the middle of the tournament bracket and you can't recalibrate, sorry. Ooh! <laughs> no, actually, Dean, that. Grab? Grab. Ooh. Grab. Well, it's almost a grab. Grab. No, not that one. Oh, I guess that one, but we're not gonna finish it. But we are gonna finish it because it poked. Unless we're not gonna finish it, then we bet. That was a great position <laughs> on that bear, actually. Yeah. <laughs> Kyle's laughing. No, playing DD, um, that character, playing that character at um, DD was very fun because I played DD for my um, workmates. Yep. And they are, I'm not going to say they're stuck 30 years in the past, but <laughs> there's um, it's a little bit of a, uh, let's say they're uncomfortable with um, a certain group of people. And um, it was very, very interesting seeing certain people's reactions. That's great. Like, yep. I love that. Yep. After surgery, I'm like going back and annoying all the people that are like transphobic by being extremely hard and looking forward to it. Yep. Ah. Ah. Oh. It's gonna be some fun ones. <laughs> I, got my, I got my revenge list. It's not really a revenge list. It's just, it's just, it would just be funny interactions. Yep. yep. I just like making people uncomfortable. Oh. Hey, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> Something beautiful about it. Challenging people's ideas by existing. <laughs> Wait, how, what, how does that work? Do I do I run ads? How do I run ads? Redeemed ad time. Is it? Do you I? Re you really picked a time to cash in points with like two people that had some semblance, but not a lot, of um how to run a stream. Which was your mistake, really. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna, I was wasted points, unfortunately. I'm yep. sorry, Shai. I'd run up ads if I could. Spending your points on an advertisement, you should go to hell, Alex. What the fuck? Yeah, I mean, I don't no, know what I you expected, just, really. I, I don't know how to run yeah. ads. <laughs> I'm, I'm just a girl. Okay, you're not just a girl. You run ads. How do you run ads? How do you run ads? I'm going to hit no. slash run ads. It didn't work. Unrecognized command. Unrecognized command. I'm out of ideas. Yep. Oh no, Carl. Carl. Yeah, Carl's. Oh. Just, that was the. Oh. Everything Ooh, has gone wrong nice. in two seconds. Yeah. No this is not losers quarters. This is losers. It's Samis. also not. Fir it's first of three. So I, I also said I'm like, it's not first. It's not. It's not best of three. Who uses first of three? Stupid FGC heads. Yeah. It's confusing. Nice tech shade. Oh, actually, actually hitting stuff. Oh, what's dash stack of all time though? I'm gonna try not to do that dash stack. Alex, come cheese! I need to start, yeah, I need to start pumping out advertisements for the big cheese. I also need to enter the big cheese. Man, that sucks. Ooh. It'll be nice. It's always, it's always just a cool tournament. Yeah, that's, yeah, I'm not, I'm not looking forward to I'm not looking forward to that. I think that, that it is just an unfortunate time of year as well. I'm not, I, ha I have to like cram a bunch of mini stuff. Ooh, oh, geez, that was actually awesome. really good. What the hell? I wasn't looking. Maybe Kai did something. If that was down smash instead of jabbing, but I got something. Maybe we got 2%. Or something. What a 2. Alright. Uh, that was a good well. double dare. I've been there. I'm just like standing there with Falker. Fucker's just the dare, and I'm like, ah! So smart. <laughs> it's like, they really can do that. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, oh no, he's fine. <gasps> Big up air, but no idea how to combo after it. I feel. Oh, oh great! Uh, the great fair. Can we actually. get an edge guard? No. Can we get a. No. no. You, didn't, you, didn't wait for my, you didn't wait for me to say the second thing. No. This time. Oh, we could down smash that. Probably. Yeah, we could have. It's tight though. Mm -hmm. 
Nice. Yes. Yes. We got a four. To, we, we, get, we get one every four. Ooh Dude, those fairs make me feel so silly. <laughs> he just spams them. <laughs> Maybe I should do that one. Maybe. It kind of work. Alright, don't get dead. I oh. love that you like taking mass tests, Shive. That's kind of beautiful. I feel like you're doing a mass test when you're playing me. So it makes sense. Oh, that's not actually really unfortunate. We won't yeah. cheer for SDs, unlike New South Wales. Yeah, I like SD. What a great guy. Yeah. It seemed like once a year, twice a year, we have lovely conversations. And that's it. That's he it. He goes back into his Eva and his like, real life. I don't know what he does. But I think. I know he plays golf sometimes, so it's probably something that makes a good amount of money. Ooh. Yeah. <laughs> nice, actually. Alright. We're not Fox, so that... Reason misogyny. Misogyny, yes. <laughs> yep. <laughs> no. Held for reason misogyny. Welcome to the club, Garth. Man. I'm teaching all the girls wrong. <laughs> nice. That was actually a really smart grab. Yeah, it was. Oh, wait. It was good time. Let's... Oh, we, we can't finish. No, we can just grab ledge. ledge. We can finish. Do I have any more? And no more DMs to Ready? stream. <laughs> Let's, Let's go, Kyle. Play. You know what? I agree. Let's go. Yeah, there's good moments here. It's just like... The thing is, there's not... Kyle always has good moments with Kai. Insane, just tank three lasers. But oh, Kyle always has good moments with Kai. It's just not enough of them to win. Mm. But Kai oh. has, has uh, even that out. Oh, go down, go down, go down. Uh, that was it. Dude, he's dead. At all times. He's dead. You yep. just put it yep. there. Yep. Instead of going down, you're dead. That shadow box. <laughs> if you ever seen the um, <laughs> you ever seen the Ronda Rousey like shadow boxing gear? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, normally it's just not enough good things to like consistently beat Kai, but that is offset by the one to two SDs a game that Kai is currently pulling out. I'll be honest, Kai's not playing that particularly crazy this tournament. Oh no, absolutely not. I don't think any of us are. No. <laughs> Sometimes it'd be like that. Sometimes you have a... Is this finishing at a decent time? Does Kai spike controllers? Um, they spiked the headset after the last set. Nope. This wasn't really a spike. It was no, more, of a, more of a like. More of a doof. We've all been there to like the slight toss aside. Be like, ah. Oh. I've never done anything. No. We're too busy slamming walls. Yeah. I'm so proud of myself that I kicked in a wall, kind of. That says a lot about me. <laughs> <laughs> Crowd is oh <laughs> wait, it's gone! Ah! Oh, almost. That was a what? good like empty, empty jump. Oh no, but like, <laughs> so when I say almost, I mean like if there was a player that could finish what Kyle was like trying to do after Kyle did the first thing, then yeah, it would be almost. So that's what I was like implying with almost. But like considering that it, Kyle won't be able. Wait, to that was a good jack. Fair backwards, nice. No, oh, that's hard well, though. That's I can't, can't call that an S. I'm gonna call that a edge guard. I have the SD, and I'm just like, that was like a free edge guard. I got you. <laughs> <laughs> but like, I mean, this makes sense. This makes sense. You just didn't execute, so like, yeah. I'll... Nice, great it's, tech chase. Yeah, uh, less good second tech. Oh, Ooh. two oh, good back tech throw. chases. Now nah, he's gonna go to legend then. <gasps> Down smash and scuffle, maybe. Oh no, we tried to go for. Oh, just lives. Oh wait. Oh, why are we going for grab here? The scuffle. Sometimes you just need a down smash. <gasps> wait, this is... Oh my god, that's great. Just... Yeah, yeah, great run up there, actually. This is... Dude, that's Kai's entering abyss mode. Down smash more? Unironically, though, like, there's some spots in the scuffle where Kai's just... Oh, uh, Kyle's just going for, like... Kyle number three on PR, question mark? Question mark? Grab. Oh, Ruben yeah, we win. Oh, win. Oh, oh, what a fair. This might be Kai's 13th rhythm. Um, still, this is... Oh, that's so... Oh, I almost got the roll. 
Alright, we are. Uh... Where are we? In sail, mate. Let's go the way. I feel that's like... kind of clutch. Yeah. Oh, wait. That... Wait. Oh, the second pair's crazy. We take 60 there. We take 60. Oh, we just got dead. It's a big follow up, but we drop it. Oh, why are we? Oh, Ooh, nice jabs job. actually work. These fairs that are... fair is just. Alright, I'm, I'm gonna do just fucking jump and fair get in stupid fair spots. In this spot, this... Yeah, Ooh, that dare was. That, so high, that float height is. That, that float height was, was, was such dare. a bad float height. Yeah, no, it wasn't the float height, it was the dare. Yeah, just think he didn't have to dare. I just think it was like such a. I think, yeah. I mean, the dare was bad, but also just like. The bad. dare's what the bear hit. Yeah. You can, yeah, you want to be like a tiny bit higher than that, but it was still, it was the dare that killed him. Alright. Because well, you can also faint that with like empty flight and then you can drop down and you drop under the bit. There's yeah. a lot of spot things you can do in that spot that Kyle didn't do. Now we fought gaming or we, um, where are we going? Yeah, I don't really know. It's, it's definitely fought. Yep. Maybe just take, taking a time, bit of time to think, to reflect. It's definitely fought. There's literally no other choice. Fought? Lots of, lots of chances for Kyle to side BF to level as well. I'd be thinking about that. Mm. What are we? What are we? Are we thinking Dreamland? I don't do not. Think I, Dreamland. I don't think Dreamland. I Dreamland is not moves. the play. Please don't go Dreamland. Please don't go Dreamland. Please don't. <gasps> no, you had it. You had the keys to the kingdom, and you decided that you. Kai can just like shoot the gun. Yeah. yeah. And, like play this mid-range spacing, and we don't know oh, how to get in. Dude, Kyle's doing so good in scuffles. Mm -hmm. This is the not scuffle stage. This, yeah. Kyle's also not good at the killing part, which is the reason this is good. Oh, start, yeah. Ky Kai's good at the comboing on this stage. This is not. You can't kill. <laughs> you can't play the long stage. You the got, other one. You, you got, got the other one. You got most of your stocks from like around in there. Yeah. At, like 110. You did. You got like. Oh, I'm so mad. Carl. Carl. Historically. Honestly, one of the worst players of picking stages. Yeah, so I was about I to say know. like historically, actually just. Pretty good at picking characters. Pretty very bad at picking stages. Nice. Ah. Uh, nice. Uh, yeah. See, it is. But like, imagine how it fought. Yeah, imagine how it fought. It could have literally just could have been a kill. All right, we're going to. Said now. That's yeah. that would have killed on. Well, at least would have set up. Yeah. Oh. yeah, we don't know how to edge guard, so we can't finish. I'm so sad. That would have. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Carl, you're. Ah. Now, the, no. I, I, yeah, I just, I just want to see Carl succeed, and sometimes it feels like Carl doesn't want to see Carl succeed. Yeah, it really <laughs> does feel like that. Eh? This, this is not sibling rivalry. No. This is simply support. Yeah. Like, this is like. This is sibling. No. Sibling. Yeah. Please. Just. Kyle, just grow up. Uh, oh. Yeah, well. I'm sad. I am because I'm like I can see the writing on the wall here. I was gonna land like another fair from here, like. Oh. Yeah. I have oh. 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 Well. Yeah, Kyle, honestly, I can't think of a person who's worse at picking stages in the same yep. currently than Kyle. Kyle's gonna be like, well, I wanted to try it. Well, like, yeah, I mean, you know, you could have tried it in, like, friendly. Or, like, game one. Alright, no, that's fine, you know. All we need is a SD. I just, I just don't see. Especially the way Kyle plays this matchup, I just don't see um, them coming back. SD could happen. That's about it. That's yeah. Yeah, but that's the thing is like I don't know. Kyle's so good at racking up 80 on the stage, and like Kyle's not good at coming back to the stage. No. So I'm like everything good about this stage is not good about this stage for Kyle. Mm. I don't know why you're here. Like I was battlefield, even would have been like you really don't want fod. I don't know. This is this, this, this is the worst. Uh, I don't understand. Not even taking Yoshi's. Yeah. Did we win on Yoshi's? No, we didn't. No. Yeah, uh, I, don't, I don't know what we're doing. Oh, yeah. What, the plot is just better Yoshi's? Oh, yeah, it's fine. Wait, did we win on Yoshi's? No, we did win on Yoshi's, so we can't go back to Yoshi's. No, we didn't win on Yoshi's. Oh, did no, we? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yep. Because oh, Kai yeah, went yeah. stadium game uh, four after losing yeah. game three. Sure. But, like, bats or fog. Oh, nice. yeah, this is oh my god, that looks like a Miranda fucking mm. neutral sequence, actually. The run up power shield and the air to shield. That's a oh. fair moment. But we don't have those. We just have no we have no way to finish. Because mm. the thing is, this stock, the only way this stock is getting taken realistically is like another two hits or whatever, and then now. Yeah. 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 And it's like. Like a random down <laughs> smash. Yeah, see, yeah, it's not it's dead. It's fine. 
Yeah, this isn't gonna kill either. Oh, well, anyway. Alright, good luck, Moscow. Thank you. Nice, that would have killed him for long sense. I still go on here, you know what? Bad guy. <sighs> It's alright, this is a comeback. So true, Kyle. No, I, the Miranda state of it. I've not bad influence. Sometimes I see the consequences of my actions, and I'm like, man. Then I don't change anything. Look. It's hard to look in the um hard to look in the mirror. Rip Kyle going to get talking to. <laughs> Hopefully Maybe. not by you, Caleb. Oh I. Well, I, if think, I, I think I think he wasn't playing you. Yep. Nah, I mean, right after a loss, nobody wants to be talked. This is definitely a um. It's a later moment. It's a later moment. Like, why do you go? Why do you go dreaming? <laughs> I'm not saying anything. <laughs> oh well. Say love you. Hugh, Sarah, Sarah. Why did we pick Dreamland? Well, what so? Oh. So yeah, that's good having you. Pay me five dollars if you haven't paid me five dollars. Oh, you did? You're the best. I love you. I didn't win, but I felt like I was doing stuff. So I'm not gonna lie, I just win that set like... I know what I win, so it's just... You literally would have won if you went pod, probably. I tried. I think I was doing stuff. You just... Dreamland might be the worst. Dreamland might be a Kai counterpick stage in a matchup, unironically. Because you can't kill, and Kai can do 80% and then kill you, and you also can't hit Kai outside of a scuffle. So literally everything you can do, like, Dreamland is like, exaggerates your weaknesses and doesn't, then like, mitigates your strengths. I guess, but like... I, was like, I just wanted to try Dreamland. There we go. We tried. Yeah. That was your opportunity. That was the the Kai SD's five sets, and we take the set. I mean, that's not the greatest set to win. You know, yeah, but you take it. You got to take it. That, that's kind of shit. Yeah, but you, you you take you take those sets. So if you don't take those sets, then you're not taking the good ones. But like. You got to take you. Gotta, when they play bad, you got to fucking heartlessly take that. Otherwise, when they play good, you're not winning. I mean, I'd rather just. I feel like, yeah, I did stuff that I can, you know, just add to my game plan in general, even the matchup will just, as a player, instead of going, yeah, I'd, yeah, I'd be, like, say if I won, like, yeah, I'd be Kai. Yeah, they sd would like, 12 times. Yeah, I respect that, but you still try to win the set. I, oh, I was, I was saying I was, and I was just saying, like, I don't know, I, I just felt happy with some of the stuff I yeah. did. Oh no, you did. You had some like really good moments. I have to steal your bears. They look so stupid, but they work enough to where I should be doing them. Um, yeah, your fares look good. And then there's like some... The power shield stuff was cool. You were overusing it a bit towards the end, obviously, but... Oh, it's it like a, I don't know. I, I need something. I need yeah. some bullshit. The run-up power shield float out and air out of shield, it was very, I uh, said it was very me-esque. It was cool to see. I know, I felt so cool doing I know, it. it was very <laughs> cute, it made me happy. He had some moments, it was good. That's my, that's my swag moment for the night. Yeah, I'm proud of you, it was cool. Besides, yeah. I'm gonna be playing Kai like God knows how many more times. Yeah. Not in Dreamland, hopefully. Maybe not. I would suggest not. Honestly, Kai should pick Dreamland against you. <laughs> so, like, watching that, I'm just like, oh yeah, Dreamland probably is Kai's best stage versus you. Yeah, I, was, I think, um, so usually when I play, like, my head's turned down and I look like I'm about to murder somebody. That just felt like I was in the Zen mode. It was kind of beautiful. I love that. Like, I'm just playing the game. My moves are hitting. I'm about to fall asleep, but I'm gonna try to do some cool stuff first. Who have wins here? I don't. I don't mean like. I hope people who are listening, like, <gasps> the free viewers. <gasps> Kai, that was sick. Is he gonna finish though? Ooh. Oh, uh, oh! I'm gonna count it. Yes. Yeah, so I wish. I wish Randall wasn't there so I could count that. 
Yeah, to the three people still watching, um, it's not like I was going, like, being not winning, it was just, I was just more relaxed, like, not, like, hyper going, okay. No, that's when you, you gotta lock in, you gotta, you gotta, when you sniff blood, when I sniff blood of, like, a better player, if Josh's controller ain't working. No, no, I don't mean that, I just mean, like, it felt like since I was in that state, it felt like I was able to play better in spots. That's good, that's beautiful. But yeah, like if I if I see Josh like look at his controller three times, I'm winning that set. <laughs> yeah. I was like, I've never I've never tried harder in any video game in my entire life. Yeah, I'm not saying I wasn't trying. It's just yeah, I know, I know, it's fine. I, I just want to make sure because also don't... if you hit them and they're below the stage, you go down. You, you go learn. Cause you like bared him and you had like a hundred seconds and then you you got burned. Yeah. So it was like you could just be dead. Instead, you were dead and you would have won the set of that. Because it was the Pokemon game. The Pokemon game was close, I think. It was. Yeah. Maybe next time. I'd love to see it. Oh, okay. Maybe do some more power shields. I think. I think like being calm and neutral was better, and then just laser focus when it comes to punish. Which sounds dumb, I'm sure, to like the one viewer we have watching. But like, I'd agree. Why not try Dream Random Friendlies? Well, I mean, we have a lot of we have a lot of these locals, and I play against Kai and like most of them. So, why not try an environment when? Yeah, it kind of I get it. I get it. I get it. It's fine. Yeah. And yeah, I'm seeing your like punish. I'm seeing like the things like slowly come together. It's good. I mean, I was there was I was really slow. Like I, it just felt like like when I was doing the stick like. <laughs> I swear to god, I'm not usually that slow, which is... I miss using this thing. Maybe you should use this thing. Nah, I'm better on this thing now. Yours is missing three buttons. I don't use those buttons. That's why, that's why it's these three buttons. I don't uh -huh. use them. Still, that's... Not the greatest. Why? There's no diff. I think just from a design standpoint, the buttons coming off. Oh yeah, this thing's a terrible piece of shit. Uh, I need. I, I think I'm gonna ask. I probably try to get one from America that's like functionally made. That's not playing. We'll see. I know. I just like how my set, my set with Kai was different in a lot of ways. Like not even like counting. Me just taking games, but I feel like I did options that I used Yeah, there were new things. Yeah, yeah I saw them. That's like, because a lot of my Kai sets, like, they homogenize. Like, yeah. Yeah. That's kind of cool. Yeah. So I'm happy with, like, what I did. Obviously, it would have been nice if I won, but, like. The worst oh, yeah. double aces of all time, and we're dead. I think we should probably change it so we don't have Kyle. Nah. Hi. Oh. That's all I need to hear. <laughs> <laughs> Kai's gonna have to watch this back and be so mad. <laughs> and that's okay. We love. Just know, Kai, I'm doing this because I love you. I'm sure she loves us back. Yeah, I'm sure she does. <laughs> Let's go, Kyle. <laughs> Kyle. 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 I just want to get like, I don't know, when there's like less brain. <laughs> I can't change it to Lyle. Why Lyle? Can you explain why Lyle? You don't have to, but you could. <laughs> we have fun here. Yeah, he's a Lyle. Wait, I've never heard that. That can't be a real name. I, there was one podcast or something with a lie on it, and that's the only way, that's the only time I've ever heard the name. That person does not exist, that's a fucking alien. That way dash, way dash, uh, up tilt was kind of crazy, actually. This must get to liar. Care to explain yourself on that one? 
Must have said that Caleb cared about the PR when Caleb actually didn't care about the PR and instead sent me 10 paragraphs about oh. how, how he didn't care about the PR. You know, how mad he was about Ooh. circumstances <laughs> around the PR. Dude, out of everyone in the scene, Caleb cares the least about the PR. Yeah, definitely. And, <laughs> Can't know, think of anyone who cares less about the PR than I, Caleb. I thought I didn't care as long as I'm on it. <laughs> I thought you didn't care as long as you're first on it, but... Yeah, but, as, uh, but out of everyone, is then Caleb just doesn't care that more than any of us. The worst get up attack of all time. Punished. What do we got? Oh, insane up air. I right, watch like Kai for like... One second periods. I'm like, wow. She's kind of got some stuff. And then I watch two more seconds, and I'm like... She has deep three times. Ooh, I get it. <laughs> Can we do an indifference PR for all of Oz? <laughs> yeah, honestly. Or we do an SA indifference PR, which... I'm, I'm kind of down to just release SA PRs that aren't our actual PR, but just, like, ranking different things. <laughs> oh, we release the old Burger Time PR. <laughs> release, like, I don't know. I think for a difference PR, I gotta be top three. Yeah, no, it's definitely... Kyle's definitely... Uh, <laughs> I reckon you care more than you give on. It really depends. Who really doesn't care? Swag's definitely, like, last. Swag doesn't make the PR. Swag cares more than anyone has ever cared. Nice call. Which Bye. is really unfortunate. <laughs> um, Caring about the game while who using Who doesn't Falcon. care? If, you know, I would care if Kim was the problem. <laughs> well, yeah, but it's like the I same PR as last time. Yeah. <laughs> What does I what actually does make sense? I love when Yellow is yelling behind me. He's always yelling. You know he was asking like, uh, so if you're up two games, can we go to Poke Floats? <laughs> no, sometimes sometimes when sometimes when well like some people don't care when they're not in PR. But like some people care a lot that they're not in PR, like Swag. <laughs> Ooh, anyway, I shot that down because I was. I, I'm definitely kind of tired and I, I'm just not in the mood for more shenanigans than like this game with the official rule set would let on. Like, I, I don't. I'm not in the mood to play fucking Pokemon Sports right now. He was even, he was even asking, you know, we could go to Mute City. Or Joggle James, so I'm like, just, just go to stadium. <laughs> I just like bullying swag, Chibe. We all like bullying swag. You have to understand that I love, I love him, but he's really fun to make fun of. And that comes first. The problem is, like, that's the best Falcon in, Austra in Australia by some metrics. So the problem is, like, Swag has to improve, but also out improve everyone above him, and enough to, like, get I guess Caleb's going. Him. Well, I guess, it will, I mean, Yellow, there's a good chance Yellow's on the next PR if he beats anyone, but... I don't know, dude, with Caleb going... Yeah, Yellow beat Riz. Yeah, but that's not, on, that's not a PR win. Well, it's kind of hard when he plays against Peach. Yeah, but, like, you gotta do it. Yeah. It's, yeah, that's what I mean. It's like, you have to be <laughs> Kyle, me, Kai, or Muscat. That's kind of fucked. I mean, Mason's on the PR. Like yeah, it's Mason's on the Yeah, I think Yellow could be Kai, but like, you gotta do it. Like, that's not easy. Also, Mason is definitely more dedicated to learning, like, actual icy stuff, like, beyond, like, handoffs and shit. <laughs> Like, I don't think Yellow wants to put in the time and effort to, like, really Mason? get good with Ice. He's not, I'm, yeah. I'm not saying I blame him. No, he has. He's, like, learned the, like, a decent amount of stuff. It's just, yeah. yeah. Really? Yeah. Like, I, he has handoffs, but, like... He has, like, some of the decent Ice stuff. It's just, like, not that good. Because he hasn't played much yet. Oh, yeah. It's, like, definitely... It's definitely, like, clearly put time into, like, learning Ice. I guess it's, it's just... Been. This game's hard. It's just, like, playing against him versus Mason, like, in the matchup, there's just a lot of spots where, like, like, if the way I play tonight, Mason would have oh. just fucking owned me hard. Yeah, that's because Mason is a better player. I know, but, like, just, just, like, the spacing and just... Yep, that's, that's, that's yeah. Mason is a significantly better player. Yeah. So, Mason will have better spacing and options. I, I know, I know. It's just things... 
you know when you. Good job, Lyle. Ooh, Lyle. But yeah, yellow can get better. Yeah. Well, I'm not saying yellow can't. It's just. That's a. This I mean. What you have to do. It's not just. No. <laughs> Well, I, think that's, I don't think that's that true in melee. I like it, really. I think of love is just getting comfortable. I really don't think that's true in melee. I do, like... No, as in the, the cast theorem. Oh. Like, that's a good generic theory to have for, like, most things. I, don't, I think... I mean, by proxy of, of most things, like, the, the, it, it, it is less of a thing in melee than it is in most other things. Mom, so I wasn't reading the chat. I was just like, no, I'm right, damn it. Because, yeah, I don't know. I started playing when I was 20. Well, 21. 20. I was 20, I think. And then, what, Lax started playing at, like, mid-20s. Like, Nick was... I don't think... I th Nick wasn't young when he started playing either. Nick was 20s, I think. Muscat was 20. Like, like dude, like, I, I, that's not true. That's not true. I started playing when I was, like, 14. Yeah, okay, I'm better I'm than Yosh. <laughs> like what? That's not, that's not, that's not, but like that, I don't think I don't think your statement statement is necessarily true at all. And there's so many kids that just suck at this game. Real. Like real bad. I used to be a kid that sucked at this game. Yeah. Now I'm an adult that that's sucks at this game. Yeah. I know. I, I think the problem is like, sucks is a word I use often, but then I remember like, I'm actually like, pylon metrics decent. Until, like, I get humbled. I don't think MSJ was that young when he started. Like, dude, like, so many of our good players aren't when they're young. Hmm. Like, I don't... That's really doesn't... Really doesn't feel like a thing. I feel like it's also, like, when you're young, you have more free yeah, time. Yeah, you have more free... That, 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 that's what I mean. And, like, most things, younger people get better because they have, like, more free time and more motivation. But I think... More so than 95% of other things, I think, melee is, like, less skewered towards the young people. Yeah, but that's probably why the whole, like, oh, younger player is going to be... Oh, yeah, that's better. what I mean. I'm just I'm saying that it that would normally make sense, but it's it's the, uh... <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, Kaz. Kaz, it was, like, it was just such a funny thought, because it was, like... It just sounded like you were trying to, like, make it so deep, and I'm like, this is, like, so incredibly wrong. I'm like, wow, it's, like, it's impressive to, like, have a thought that's, like, this incredible. <laughs> I'm like, you might have picked like the most, <laughs> the worst like example oh, that I can it. think of. I love it when I say something and the cloud just tears it to shreds. <laughs> yeah, dude. Like, I don't know if you like if you say a thought, you're like I'm just like. So, most of the time I won't care, but I just like I just like thought about it. But like I was saying, I'm like it's really impressive that you said this. I will admit you, you are around this one. <laughs> I'm like, out of everything on the planet, the, the melee is probably in like the top 10% of like things that aren't related to like being young and getting good. Not that it doesn't happen, or that it, it isn't like maybe more so than like older people getting good, but it's like, yeah, we're definitely more secure to older people getting good than like almost every other hobby on the planet. Which is really cool. I love that. We're just a bunch of boomers. Yeah, it's actually, it's actually so sick. <laughs> What do you think the chance Cody was like, what? Cody was like 20s when he started too. This is tough. No like, alright. I'm done thinking about the Garfield. If I lose, it's because I'm thinking about that Garfield comment oh, shit, that you took you five seconds already? to figure out. That's crazy. What chances do you think I have like five dollars of coins in my purse? I give it 65%. <laughs> That, other, that your next comment was also incorrect, and I, mean, I would spend the next five minutes dissecting that too. But now I have to go play Grand Finals, you asshole. <laughs> oh. <laughs> meant to say, the clan. She meant to say most. She meant to say most. <laughs> I tried. I tried, buddy. <laughs> I don't think there's anything helping it. Oh. You know, I kind of want to leave it like this, honestly. Let's. I think this is a good setup.
Yeah, I think I did it right. <laughs> Chat, does this look right? Did I do it correctly? <laughs> I am thinking with like my like my inner state. I want to be calm and I want to just I want to be in it to have like fun enough where like I don't get any sort of flustered when I'm holding down, mashing the C stick down, and it doesn't automatically get me the start. Like, I guess it's in like the Falco matchup. Definitely not a peach, you know. You definitely can't have any of that. Um, but like, I also want to be like locked in enough, like at any sort of notice, like when I get a hit, I have more moves into even more moves into taking a stock. You know what I'm saying? I'm sure someone knows what I'm saying. I'm sure Caleb understands this perfectly. He always gets me. And doesn't think I'm a fucking idiot. <laughs> oh. Whoa, hey. Maybe I should try this thing of going out when Spacey's recovering. So I've been told it's good. I don't know who said it. Though. <laughs> God, I I don't know. I love the neutral in these matches, but I also hate them because they're bad. One of those nights. Oh, well, it's definitely interesting. How often do I watch top-level peat sets? I'm thinking of a number. <laughs> zero and zero. <laughs> I should, I should, I should watch them. I just really hate learning because, like, if I don't want to, it just feels icky and I, I don't like spending my time like that. But, like, learning when I'm just having fun with it already. And just because I want to improve while I have more fun. That's... that's how it sticks. I think I did the setup correctly. I think I did the setup correctly. Mean Lady versus Lyle. Yeah, that's about right. Yeah. Yeah, I agree, Caleb Video Games. Watching top level melee is fun. Speaking of, down smash kills. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> Uh, when is it never not cool? Man. Down smash is fun. I don't know what Caleb is talking about. Riz, you, you think Peach Down Smash is fun, right? I think it is. Oh uh, my god, I was not expecting that. Here's the thing, right, about Peach's Down Smash. It's punishable. It is punishable. Uh, there's like a lot of very interesting tech about it, and it's very unique to Peach. Because no other move in the game really works like that. Uh, like, it is incredible at edge guarding, but also at the wrong percents, you can like ride the wave uh, to get sent the other way. So, like, uh, what's the thing? Very often, like, if the fox recovers kind of onto stage, the peach can go onto the ledge side of fox and then down smash them, like, away off stage. But as Fox, what you can do is, you can actually strategically ASDI down the first hit, and then ASDI up the second hit. There's a video by, I think, Pew Pew Yu, covering how to do it as math, but it works as Fox as well. But, I don't know, I feel as though Down Smash on Peach really is the source that brings together the whole dish, you know? And it's fun. Sometimes you see stupid stuff like people wave shining peach to 64%, getting like the peach SDIs once, down smashes, gets the exact same 64% back. It's so good. It is. It's wonderful. Mm. I feel as though, um, honestly, out of you and McLeod, I, 
honestly believe that, like, I think both of you should down smash more. And maybe it's just that I'm not pressuring either of you enough, but I noticed that at least now, McLeod is down smashing way more than she does against me. So that leads me to believe that it is a matter of kind of pressuring McLeod into it. And I feel as though a lot of the time she feels as if she can win without it, and it, I mean, it's true. But, yeah, Let's see how it goes. Ooh, this is the image guard there. That may be better. Well, down smash for Peach, but, like, it, obviously it's good in the last spot for that one matchup, but, like, depending on who you're up against, it's very, like, dependent what it's going to be doing a lot of the time. Like, obviously you got the on-plat mix-up of doing a down smash if you think they're going to try and hit you with something, and you got it as an edge guard or just as an option after you do an aerial on shield, but, like, like, say, um, against Fox, right, since Peach Fox on the screen, sometimes you can do it, like, um, like, just move back a bit, whether we're running back, or, like, just wave dashing back to catch Fox's movement. Yeah. Sometimes it just catches the tail, because yeah, yeah. life's good. Yeah, I mean, the tail is big. Of course, now that I think about it, of course Caleb would say watching Top Level Melee is fun. I've seen him. <laughs> We've been eating dinner at Hungry Jack's He's been on his phone watching Melee while we're all hanging out. <laughs> I think maybe you enjoy watching it a bit too much, Caleb. Enjoy life. Live in the moment. I was playing a set against uh, Swag, and <laughs> I just hit the nastiest combo against Falcon. I was like, up throw, shine, that was crazy stuff. And I, I like immediately turned to him and was like, oh, you like that? And he made fun of me. And just like, oh, yeah, you're living in the moment. He thought that, you know, it'd be something we'd talk about after the set, maybe even a couple of days later, because it was that memorable. <laughs> it's just like, I don't know, when you hit something nice, you got to appreciate it. you got to live in the moment. Enjoy every second of melee that the game has to offer. I'm telling you, there's so much to this game. I know. I, actually, recently I was playing this game, but not not comparatively, not on Unring to a friendlies in like a traditional tournament sense. I mean, I was playing like still one on one, but like with items on and just non tournament stages. And yeah, it's it's a different game. And I was having fun. That was pretty fun. I think I think it's good. Like sometimes just take a break or just has some of the really wacky parts of this game. Like, yeah. It's just a breath of fresh air. Like It is. I mean, I've literally just come up with, like, I don't know, playing against bots. And it's like one of those things where it's like, just moving the characters is fun. I think that's one thing that I appreciate appreciate about Melee more than most other games. I've been playing a lot of Path of Exile. And Here's the thing about that game, it's great and all that, but the movement does not feel great. You move around the character and it kind of feels sluggish and laggy. You play melee, it's crispy cream. You press left, it goes left. You press the down smash button, boom, comes out. And I don't know, it's just so fun to move around the character. And it feels so horrible when your fucking conch destroys you. But either way, that's just me complaining. It's a fun game. Oh, that's fun when you do that. That's something that I don't know if that's like a new thing, but I swear, if, like it happened once at like floating point, like not this floating point, but the floating point before, and now I see it like constantly. So I don't know. Strange moments where the cloud would just SD, which is like a strange thing to happen because Peach is not a character that SDs. Um, I know it sounds strange, but there's a lot of moments where you can easily not SD with the character. Like, if you accidentally burn your float. Yeah, like weirdness with floats, yeah. Like, that definitely comes up more than you think. Yeah, that reminds me of, like, I don't know. I, there was a passing comment somewhere, somewhat, like one time. But just, like, the idea of, like, how many times has Armada SD'd in tournament? Oh, I really yeah. don't think that guy has ever killed himself. Mm. And it's, like, it's astonishing. I think Armada, out of any player, must have the least SDs. But now that I think about it, I mean, he switched to Fox. Like, even then, you'd think once, maybe, but... I don't know. I feel as though it very much is a person-to-person -person kind of thing. 
I definitely have a massive problem with it. And it's something that I've been trying to fix, but I mean, not that much. I haven't even barely been playing, but yeah. I don't know. Maybe McLeod and I both need to go on a soul searching journey in order to figure out why we're SDing. I mean, that's just in general. Like when you, like when you keep punching a lot of bugs, you generally are just gonna have either some sort of lapse in judgment, or you forgot, like that you didn't have flow anymore. Or you just press it too fast. And you something forget happens. where you are for a moment. Like, you wake up in a strange room. <laughs> you don't know what's it's, been happening. It's really easy to actually kind of SD with Peach. Like not just like float stuff, but like get getting battlefielded mm. when you're like just going with the parasol. Yeah. Like obviously it's not like spaces or like just any character doing ledges. But even with the parasol, I think like you can pretty much avoid it every time by holding back. You know? I know, but sometimes you just really want to get to ledge ASAP. Yeah, sometimes you're just holding it, but I don't know. The, the annoying thing is is that the trick with avoiding getting battlefielded on most characters is just holding back as you like approach the ledge. But when you're like up being towards the ledge as Fox, sometimes it doesn't even matter. You can be holding back and still get battlefielded. Yeah. Which kind of sucks, but oh well. I think it's great. <laughs> <laughs> of course hey, you do. Hey, but, if you want to bash my character, yeah. I... I understand, I'm here for you, we can have um, a back and forth. I love Peach. I actually think Peach is great. I think Peach is, um, maybe, maybe I'm a down player of Falcon, but I think Peach is so much of, so much of a better character than Falcon. But this came up with Swag where we were talking about, like, how I think we both, Swag and I, are down players of Falcon, but maybe it's just because there aren't any good Falcons in Australia. Because he was playing uh, that good old school Falcon recently, and then he said, like, oh, he kind of believes in Falcon now. But I don't know, I think it maybe is just a regional thing where people need to get on their game. Maybe maybe I'm overestimating Peach just, just because McLeod's good. No, Peach is really I, good. Yeah. Like, looking at a kid, like, I'm with full confidence. I mean, I'm not really sure what to say, but, like, definitely really good and definitely well deserving of, like, the high tier placements yeah. on tier lists. Um, Falcon is still pretty good. I just think people are bad, they panic, and then they get, like, eaten up because they got hit. You see, the reason why I think. I view Falcon as bad is because I feel like Falcon plays into the human aspect of the game, whereas I like to be a bit more robotic. And I feel as though characters in general that kind of play into human emotion, I tend to downplay. And characters that are more like surgical and more analytical, I think I overrate. So I definitely think that's why I think that, you know, Fox is pretty good, Martha's pretty good, Sheik. I think Sheik is maybe top three. But, I'm not sure if I'd go with that one, personally. Yeah, but unfortunately we've had just like no good Sheiks for a long time. Yeah. There's Jamu now, but I mean, I still think there's a lot to the Sheik that really hasn't been done. I feel like, I don't know, every Sheik I've ever versed, even in Australia, just kind of feels like they're using so little of the character. You know, use your tools, use everything. <laughs> and it's just there's people where you just kind of run at them and they'll robotically F tilt every single time and you just think like, man, if Sheik's put one ounce of more effort into the game, they could do so much better. I guess. Oh, wow. Well. I, I just think the character is like... Is Cass still here? I have business. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry, sorry if I took that off. Sorry, I'm just angry because Cass said something incorrect in chat and I have to fix it. Did you like what I did? With Is Garfield still here? What do we have? Mean <laughs> <laughs> Garfield, are you here? Cassandra. Garf. Garf. Cassandra. Cassandra. I'll get you later. <laughs> oh, I would not want to be in those DMs. All right. <laughs> ah. <laughs> All right. All right. Well, I'm going to pack up. I know. Oh, it's... Do you want you're just you're doing <laughs> it on purpose now. <laughs> next time I'm next time I'm putting this dumb lady. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you're good. Do you want to chat? Uh, or do you just want to no. do literally anything? Uh, yeah, right, sure. All right. How'd you find the set?
We were talking about stuff. Yep. Stuff? Wow, yeah. That's so fascinating. I know. Oh, it was, yeah, it was pretty shit. That's okay. Um, yeah. I don't know. I, I was, I went into this tournament being like, if I win, I get back into it. If I lose, I get back into it. I was, that was, that was just like, I'm like, I don't know. Muscat had like two hands and eyes. I would have lost that set. So it's like, I don't know. I gotta grow up. Mm. I got a good man coming back, good woman coming back in a few months. And then there's a lot of really good people at Cheese and I'm just, I'm not doing the solo practice. Uh, I'm not doing the solo practice. I'm not doing the VODs. I know like, I don't know. I'm so sick of just like doing good and then just like not keeping the foot on the pedal. So I am, this time I'm going to try and make sure it's different. I guess, but like, it's okay to just take a break, especially. Yeah, I did. It was a week. I know, but like just enough so that like you don't get burned out or just don't feel bad when. Yeah, not. I did. No, yeah, so you're just good. You're just. Yeah, I'm good. It's just, this is my getting, kicking yeah. my ass moment. So I had, like, I just didn't, like, when I got back from floating point, I didn't touch my lay for a week. Oh. Um, I didn't touch my lay for a week. It was good. And I'm, I'm just, like, I started to want to play towards the end of the week, which is good. And I wanted to play in this tournament. It's just, like, I don't know. I just saw the Twitch chat. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, Clem. I love Clem. <laughs> Muscat's ledge dash is a cleaner than my ball tuck. Yeah, yeah. No, I've actually... Like, I used to just not take breaks playing this game. And, um... Uh, it doesn't... Like... Uh, most of the time... I, yeah, I said I used to I used to not take play breaks. I just play secondaries. But now I, now I just take breaks. Mm. And it helps me a lot. I just take breaks when I feel I need to take breaks. And turns out it's pretty good. Like, every sports... Bef- psychology professional ever and any any performance athlete that says breaks are good are good and they were right I'm shocked that's crazy I don't know it feels like I have a lot more discipline now and I, d- I just want to keep the foot on the pedal for the rest of the year where it's just like I, d- I don't want to get ego around it I don't want to like I just want to I just want to play and I want to keep getting better oh. and I want to be able to put my heart into like every major that's coming up this year well, I don't know I've spent too long being shit man way too long being shit like fuck dude Rectangle, oh, it like rectangle made it like just exaggerated by like two years, but I learned a lot of cool things on rectangle, and I think I'm I'm happy. I think I'm like I, I'll get to the point where I'm happy. I picked rectangle pretty soon. Like I already, I already like it already feels better. But like when I say already, I mean I've been playing on it for two years, so you'd hope so, but you know. Yeah. I know. It's just I feel like like at locals, obviously you want to build up for when it really matters, like at majors. Or well, if there's a specific one you really want to win for whatever reason, like may- maybe Devin comes back or whatnot. But like I feel like for these, it's just better to just take it like less serious. Like obviously in your mind you should be winning, and I get that. But like no, it's not about winning really. It's about consistently showing better gameplay under pressure, which oh. I did do in the in the past and. I played like shit today, but my shit, and like, again, like, I haven't been playing the game properly, um, and that shit was better than my shit, like, two months ago, like, not, not even close. So it's like, I don't know, it's, like, I am getting better, but I, like, I'm very aware that if I don't put, keep my foot in the pedal and I don't go back to proper practice, then it's not going to last. Because me getting better was the result of me playing the game every day, playing good people every day, playing, like, solo practice every day, watching VODs every day, and, like, really wanting to get better. And it's good. I still, like, really... Like, I'm looking at situations and I'm, like, trying to learn, and I still, like, really want to... Like, I don't really feel the want to win that much anymore, which is good, where I'm just like, I just want to be better. Like, it feels like the want to be better is stronger than the want to win. So, I don't know. I was like, if Muscat gets me, Muscat, like, I'm, I'm like, that's the kick in the ass I need anyway. But I'm like, I'm going to try my heart out to, to not. But, all right, that's probably it. Yeah. It's me rambling. But I would like to be good at this game one day. And I'm going to try really hard to do it. What is good at this game? Like, if you had to quantify it. Top 10. Top 10 in... The minimum. And then once I get there, I probably want to get better than that. Well... Oh. That's rough. <laughs> yeah. But it's fun. I get to learn a lot about myself along the way. Mm-hmm. As I mean, like, my bare minimum is better than Josh. Well, that's, like, such a boring goal. 
So we'll see. We'll see. Now, I guess top 10 is better than Josh, Mr. 11. So who knows? I don't know. It feels like after Josh, with how much work he did by himself, it doesn't feel like anything less than Josh is impressive given that we have the blueprint of Josh and like way more resources than he had. So I don't know. And like a honestly like a like a scene that's getting quite strong too. Meanwhile, I just want to like, I just want to have fun. My eyes are really pretty. Be better. Yeah. <laughs> Be better than like everyone below me. Maybe take some names here and there, and like win doubles. Uh, I would love to win doubles. I'm gonna start playing more doubles. Mm. We can start. We should start. We should start doing doubles more. I could like have you over because like. There's just people playing doubles like every day now. Yeah. And I'm like kind of down for it. Well, if you want to have me over, I could just come by. Yeah, yeah, I might. We'll, we'll work something out because I want to play. I definitely want to play at least like three or four double sessions with you before Big Cheese because I'd like to win doubles. And I'm playing doubles with Michael when I go to Schlokels. Mm. I've got uni assignments. Um, I'm pretty much banned from Melee after this tournament for a few days until I get my shit done. Yeah. Um, but. I will, yeah, I don't know, we'll see. And I also am not, I'm not in the, my doubles is not in that level where it's worth taking to a tournament. I just need to play the game. But yeah, I, I've been motivated for everything that's not uni assignments. So we need to figure that out. I think I just need to accept that I don't give a fuck about uni this semester and just do it for the sake of doing it so I can do other things. Mm. Anyway, I should let Kai finish backing out. Love you all. Bye-bye. Yeah. Thanks for watching, everyone. If you haven't already, Big Cheese. Oh, if you don't already know, Big Cheese is coming up in a few week in like six. Uh, in like six weeks' time, um, October eleventh to thirteenth. You know where to go. Big Cheese. Um, so a lot of people have been giving us quite a bit of feedback, quite a bit of flack about the $80 entry fee for the month of October, sorry, for the month of September onwards. Um, I'm in discussions with the organizers. We'll see what we can do. Maybe we do a flash sale, maybe not. We'll see. If, it, if we do, it'll probably be this weekend of the Cheese League that's coming up. And we'll put it down to 70. So if you're interstate, and you're interested in signing up, and you thought eighty dollars was too much, then maybe we'll have a little flash sale this Saturday, Sunday, coming up. Um, what else was there to say? Um, in the event that we do do that, we'll offer some free goodies to the people who did sign up for the full eighty dollars. Um, yeah. Just so you're all aware, <laughs> like, <laughs> we're so far in the hole. So, just putting that out there. Um, if you would like there to be another Big Cheese, I would really like for you guys to sign up to Big Cheese and come this year. Because um, I'll be really sad if I can't do another one. Um, I would really, really like to be able to do one where I set up the third strike cabinet and run a third strike tournament on arcade hardware and then hopefully next year after people know that I'm doing that we can get more of a big bracket for it that that would be my dream if you if you don't want to crush my dreams please sign up to Big Cheese and come this October 11th to 13th um, arcade is going to be huge this year it's going to have like more than 100 tables it's massive Please, I'm basically e-bagging at this point. If you can come to Big Cheese this year, please do. Um, so I assume Ryan was saying for me to raid Nick. Is that what's going on? Yeah, okay. SA Nick Gaming. He's playing Resident Evil. Cool beans. Okay. Um, 
We should probably report the rest of this bracket. And while we're here. Yeah, I'll, I'll get the results for that another time. Um, yeah. Yeah, please support Big Cheese by coming October 11th to 13th. Uh, yeah, we had like a $3,000, $4,000 loss last year. Just so that you know, we had we made negative money, negative four digits last year. So it'd be nice to have people come this year. I will see you next time, everyone. Now I'll go raid you off to Nick. As always, the vods can be found on SA Smash TV on YouTube. And yeah, if you don't already, follow the socials. I'll see you next time. Bye, everyone.